Hello everyone, how are we doing? Hopefully you can hear me if I press this button, it should go live. Boom, hello, how are we doing? There's alerts going off, everything's blowing up, it's exploding everywhere. How are we doing everyone? Hopefully you can hear and see me all right. Uh, I'm still getting used to having the mic on this side of the desk, so it's really annoying at the minute, but let me know if you can hear me. I've changed around my setup like radically today, so everything looks different. This thing's really fucking annoying being hit. I've sworn in the first 30 seconds, this is demonetized. Let's just quickly change this around without breaking it. Um, Hello everyone, oh dear, let's just tilt it like that, there we go. All the peaceful music started, sorry you're getting slightly a lot of view of the wrist at the minute. That sounds wrong but you get the point. Right, go, sit there. There you go, that way I can still see the screen. No, don't do that. Right, behave. If this falls apart in a minute, we know why. And also, honestly, the lockdown hair is not going well, is it? How are we doing everyone? You're currently watching me join the standard system inside of Star Citizen. Hello, yep, you can see me. Let me know if you can hear me right by the way. Uh, yeah, as I said, I changed my entire set. I literally rebuilt my whole desk in the space of the last hour. So that's why we was running a little bit late because, uh, yeah, everything's been back put back together. It's a brand new desk. It's nice. It's a little bit lower than the other one. So, like, things are a weird angle. Like, I probably need to change the camera in slightly. But you can still see stuff. I can't see myself that much. But, hey, I mean, it works. You know, we're having fun. I've lost the mouse. Where's the mouse gone? Oh, where is it? Oh, there it is. Honestly, we start these streams, it's chaos. Right, let me just bump that up slightly. There you go, you can hear the music. Coming through. There you go, you can sort of hear it. All right, uh, what's the ship of choice tonight? I hope we get some MSR gameplay. So tonight we're going to be using the Hammerhead, uh, which is a ship we intended to use quite a while back uh, for some other gameplay stuff, but never got a chance to as it blew up on entry. The only problem with this desk is there's a giant bar under it, so I'm going to kick that numerous times over the next like couple of years while I own this. Um, but yeah, hello everyone, how are we doing? From the duty, hello, hello, hello. Blame crowds and mic stand breaks. Exactly. He was meant to be here tonight, though he's being miserable and didn't join us, so yeah. Uh, pain of endless loading screens. We are here though, and it looks like everyone's on board the station, so if Jack actually tabs into the game, we could get started. Uh, I'm gonna kill the music in a minute, and we're gonna hop into Discord, but first let's, uh, actually we'll leave it here, won't we? There you go. I'll just hide the chat as well. We do not want the chat popping up. Right, let's uh, murder the music a second. Here we get That was the wrong things we kill. There we go. Right, you should be able to just hear me now. And uh, if I unlock Discord, you should all be able to hear me. Hello. Right. Hello, Jack. Hello, Always yeah. just, you know, time giving us a commentary since I'm mute. It's great, isn't it? Yep. Hello, right. <laughs> yeah, How are you gents right. doing tonight? Goody, goody. Pretty good. Yeah. Very nice. So tonight I am joined by Mr. Chris, my head admin. Hello, Chris. Hello. I've got Leon. Hello. Major Concern, aka Reed. Uh, hello. Owen. Hello. And finally, Time Doctor. Hello. There we go. Right, gents. Are we all on board the station? Because I didn't manage to get into the server and spawn, so... Yeah. Yes. Um, if you come up to... So if you come out of the hab zone, you, you should pretty much be where we are. Yeah, do I need... Do I need call the elevator a sec? There you go. Uh, what's it for? Where's the... Oh, lobby. Okay. The elevator is touch wood. Well, this isn't desk isn't wood anymore. Shit. Um, that's wood. Touch wood. It's still... The elevators are still working, so... <laughs> I've not had any issues with them today. But I'm getting phantom help. signals though. That bottle of drink on the. Yeah, I mean, yeah. A sign on the ground or something? Okay. Wait, the signals like for players are a bit out of sync. Uh, yeah. Also, one of the NPCs is sat in the ground over here. Should That's we be concerned thing. or? Calisthenics. Oh. Can you see that? I can't see your signal. If that's someone. Oh, it's Leon. Okay. Yeah, they all delayed. Line up on the ground. What the hell is going on here? Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. Um, Things going on here. Nothing to look at. It's just some worms hanging out. But am I spawning in the hammerhead? And are we going to get going? Yeah, yeah. just spawn in the hammerhead. And we'll right, fantastic. We got. Uh, should have enough people to correct. All right, and gentlemen, we treat this ship with respect. All right, you don't just run on board instantly. You follow proper protocol. It's going to be fun. Right, I, I shotgun the captain's quarters. Pro no, I get the captain's quarters, but you can be on the bridge with me if that helps. You can fly it, Reed, if you want. Flying I've not got the HOTAS set up today, so I yeah, would... I up, but... The, the mouse and keyboard controls are actually good, so I'll give it a fly if people want, but... Don't yeah, I'll fly it. Fuck it, why not? What could possibly yeah, go wrong? Um, yeah. You'll have access to missiles as well, Jack. Hang on for you, gents. Yeah. Missiles, eh? Okay. Yeah, um... So you oh, use what? middle mouse to... <laughs> <laughs> Someone... <laughs> did you die? <laughs> yeah, we just died in front of us. I'm not even... Oh, did he, like, trip over the elevator door or something? Oh, no. Yeah, he did. Okay. Uh, Reed, Reed, did you die? 
Hello chat, how are we doing? Can I join Discord? Yep, the Discord is discord.gg slash Captain Jack. Uh, Finn should be in the chat if he's moderating and uh, drop a link in there. So Mr. Finn, if you're listening to us, please drop a link. Uh, in regards to open crew, we're not doing an open crew right now. In the future, we may do some more um, sessions where you can come and join, etc. Uh, for now, we're just testing to see how the game's performing and uh, go from there. But uh, hopefully we'll do some more in the future. I do want to do some more stars and gameplay. But that's why we're testing today. The upcoming patch, which is 3.13, isn't it, Chris? 3.12.1's got the Xeno threat mission in. Which is what we want to attempt. So if we get like the Discord yeah. together for like a big mission, uh, that'll be something to do, etc. So yeah. That'd be cool. Yeah, this is my elevator. Piss off to the back one. All right. I'm coming back. I don't know who's on here with me, but... <laughs> Definitely not Reed. Definitely Names not don't Chris. update. <laughs> oh, Chris just popped yeah. in. Chris, Chris. Are you the one in the orange armor, Chris? Or like yellowy black stuff? No, no it's white and red. I'm, I'm in the this one. You look like Sam Fisher Price. Do I? Sam Fisher Price. Yeah. Baby's baby's first night vision goggles. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, right. Not so, missing. what yeah. is planned? Where is who is on what? Well, I'll go to the bridge, obviously. Uh, everyone else, uh, take a turret. What hanging are you in? Three. Uh, three, lovely. In which case, uh, dibs on the upper turret, I think. Yeah, dibs on that one. I do yeah, love I the bridge of a ship. It is very cool. Uh, guys, don't power up your turrets while we're in the hangar. Otherwise, there might be uh, some good old. We're gonna get clipped down. off as we exit. <laughs> uh, chat. At least Leon's not flying with ship. No, the last time, um, was it Leon who flew? The last time we crashed, was it Reed? Oh, it was definitely Leon. <laughs> yeah, it was Leon. No, Leon fell off. Uh, That's what happened. No, I fell out and yeah. then you crashed. That was still, I, I think, one of the best that. moments we've ever done in Star Citizen. It's like Reed got no. Yeah, I know. And the whole yeah. thing just blowing up. Yeah. In my defense, the joystick decided to die. Uh, make the elevator a big gap, what is it? Uh, I've been thinking of getting Star Citizen any good. Star Citizen is a heavy in-development game. Uh, do your research if you are thinking of getting it. It is not a fully complete game by any means. Um, but if you'd like to get in, test it out and experience it, then go for it. But maybe wait for a sale is what I'd advise uh, and go from there. Definitely research it for around. Watch YouTube videos, watch arguments, you know, why you should get it, why you should get it, etc. And make your own mind up. I'm not going to tell you to get it, but what I'll say is I do enjoy it, but I am heavily critical of the development anyway. That's just me because I've been supporting it since 2000 and... 15, 16 now, I think, is when I first got into Star Citizen. Um, but I've seen the project for a while. Right, gents, are we all on board? Yes. Uh, yep. uh, is Everybody's there a med bay on here? No. No. Nope. Ah, okay. Are they going to put med bays on all ships eventually, or? Uh, or at least the big uh, ones? Uh, unlikely, because it will devalue ships that have a medical purpose. True, I guess so. Yeah. I'm just thinking, like, there's a big, like, obviously, the Idris and stuff must carry them, isn't it? They're like capitals. Yeah, that, that'll have one. Yeah, yeah I would have thought. Yeah, like the capitals will. Oh, wait, are we all clear to depart? I'm that uh, Corvette didn't yeah. have a med bay. Or like a med station. I think the Constellation should have one, at least the Exploration one. What, they should put, put a new module in for it? Well, it makes it like that's Exploration out, but if you die, you don't want to spawn all the way back to the system. Yeah, that wouldn't make really sense, would it? Didn't they? They, yeah. They gave it a med bay because of that's its role. But... In the Constellation of Jomodo, uh, that was the Exploration variant as well. Hmm. All right, gentlemen, stand by for takeoff. This is your captain speaking. Please keep all arms, other shit, and your apples inside of the car at all time. And that's a big door. Oh, my apples. They're everywhere. <laughs> I dropped my croissant. I've just shared a mission with everybody. Oh, Accepted it. I have not got that mission. But I will hit the button to accept oh. it. Oh, I did. Good. Go hey. Claim hashtag 233-0BG. What was that? So I don't think, think I got it. it. Hey, uh, uh-oh. Right, uh, we're not taking off. The doors have closed. Is anyone on the oh. landing services again? Uh, is anyone on the <laughs> bottom? Get by the way? No, I'm not. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting on it right now. Oh, new. Open the freaking doors. <laughs> uh, I'll take the top turret then. Uh, it looks like they're getting confused. The doors. I'll I'll wait for them to close, then I'll call again. Yeah, the doors in this game aren't the best. Uh, the amount of times I've been shot in the doors with my caterpillar is. Yeah. A lot. Eventually, a lot. we will get out of this hangar and oh, there we go. We're starting this whole process again. So we are what? Oh. 10 minutes into the stream? Um, <laughs> something like that. I love my counter yeah. render. Where is it? Uh, 13 minutes. Into... How do I get out of the turret doors again? You don't. Uh, okay. You just you start getting out for life. Great. Stay there. You're not allowed to move. And it's probably not a good idea to move in this thing while we're quantuming anywhere or anything like that. Alright, we're just gonna attempt take off anyway. Yeah, just go. Just oh god. Hope for the best. Hope for the best. Oh, you, did you just what? fall off? Oh. Time just fell off. Oh, no. 
Well, you're going to have to um, transition to us. Let me get out of the zone quickly. And... Yeah. <laughs> you have to meet up. What's the button yeah, to go I'm... third person again? Uh, F4. F4. Time if you jump out by hangar and then just run. Ooh, that's something right in front of us. I didn't see that. Yeah, yeah there's new turrets they've added. <laughs> Do they need to park it right side the hangar? I mean, no. Uh, it might be worse to stop here as time can't put a ship to fly to us. Yeah, that's cool. I was trying to clear that turret. Yeah. Okay, I need to then go to a pad and then... Okay. No, time. Didn't you jump out the hangar? Uh, no, the hangar has a little blip that I can't jump out. Oh. So, great. Let's go to a pad uh, and veto light. Mm. Uh, we want to be under hangers, wouldn't it? It would be nice if we had a sun around it. It's so dark at the minute. Yeah, near yeah. it. Tell you what, though, even in the dark, the ship does look cool. And the in game music up. The, the, the lights, darkness, and kind of just starfield and whatnot give me expansion. Honestly, vibes. I can't wait. I, I totally agree as well. No talk about the expanse found today because people probably haven't seen it. I, I know we're all <laughs> busting. Yeah, 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 shush. Because, hmm, so we're not talking about it. So we're on next week, we do some stuff as well. Um, speaking of which, by the way, because we did Starbase last week as our Wednesday streams, they're rolling out more EA invites soon. So, Reed, have you signed up for that? Uh, I did. I've signed up. A I've re signed up a couple of times just to be safe. Check your emails for that, because um, it might be hidden in the promotion tab. Like, you know, Gmail hides stuff away if you use that one, or whatever email you use. Yeah, actually, while we're waiting, I might tap out and have a look. That's where you've got one. Get sent from... Something the... at... Sorry. Senders called, like, Starbase Alpha. Right. So if you just search that in your inbox. Uh... I got my invite on New Year's Day, and didn't realise until they sent out a ping in their Discord. Crikey. Want me to wish you a Happy New Year, innit? I was like... That alpha tester, can you do this survey for us? And I'm like, what? Why am I getting this ping? <laughs> uh, no, it doesn't look like I've got one. I'll, um, I'll have a look at it. Might have to re-sign up again. Uh, if it's right. not too many times, settled deep the system. But um, if you yeah. sign up once, you're fine. How's that? Pressing fire, sorry. We're in arms right. zone. Stand down. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. slowly coming towards you. How can we fire turrets? And can we just not piss off the local yeah, people no. anyway? Just Should don't fire. Local. Don't fire. The bug, no, don't, not. don't fire. <laughs> Can we uh, these turrets decide to take us out? Have you tried the bartender? I haven't. What is the Discord? Discord is discord.gg slash Captain Jack. Hopefully this year, Star Citizen can use its development. Uh, we'll be doing more events in there and have our organization brought up to date more. Uh, it just depends on how we find the game and how good it is. Jack, how did you get this game? Uh, I bought it years ago um, on their website. You can still buy it to this day. Uh, but again, I'd say maybe wait for a sale. It could be a bit more convenient, especially right now because money's tight. Um, just keep that in mind. Yeah, as I was saying, Starbase is going to CA soon. Um, or, sorry, going to EA soon. That's the word we use. So that's something to look forward to. Um, and hopefully we do some more stuff in there. But yeah, we definitely want to do more Star, uh, Star Citizen events. I'm going to get confused between freaking games at this rate. Hey guys, did you see today that Space Engineers is going to crossplay apparently, between Xbox and um, obviously PC, not PlayStation? That's a silly idea. I mean, no, well, sorry, no, it's kind of cool, but it's a silly idea because what they're going to do, it, like open up Xbox more? Or I think PC. the way I think it's going to go is there'll be servers specifically built... Um, to tailor to the Xbox things, a bit like Minecraft Bedrock Edition does it, you know, where like you can play Minecraft oh, across yeah. all the things, but you're limited to like one specific game mode. I think that's how it's going to go. Uh, it remains to be seen. Uh, I don't think, and I have a feeling the only time those servers will be accessible, they're only going to be ran by Keen, or you'll have to buy through like Nitrado, etc., if you want to host a cross play server. I don't think people like me and Chris, you know, and our community are going to be able to do it because currently we can't get Xbox servers anyway. So I'm not even sure if that's a possibility. It remains to be seen. Oh, thank you, phone. How they're going to roll it out. My iPhone is just like, I'm going to vacate across the desk now. Okay, so this desk is black. So my phone holder now like blends in with it, along with the phone itself. So that's why I just, just knocked it out of its holder. Whoops. Nice, love that. I've been keeping a sort of close eye on Xbox development. I've seen bits here and there but like with keen streams and patch notes. And from what I understand, it's getting very similar to what PCs can do, provided it's on a server. Yeah. So... We may see, like, something unrestricted servers in a similar sense to PCs, but you're still going to be facing the limitations of the console itself. And I believe they've discussed, like, scripted mods and in-game scripts for Xbox running only on dedicated servers, so they run just on the server rather than on the client. That makes sense. It'll definitely limit it. So, um, I don't think we'll be able to do it. No, and also I'm not not particularly fussed with it currently. As well, I'd like to. It does offer a limited experience, so I don't really want to do that for the public servers. If there was a way to conveniently do it, then I'd think about it. But it's not something. Um... Uh, chat, how are we doing? Um, when will you stream more Dual Universe when they fix the game? 
no, I've got some just qualms of dualness. I've really turned off towards gameplay lately. You see my last video I made about that? Uh, it's just not really gelling with me right now. I would love to do more DU. It's just I really can't be asked. I will probably be doing a video or two soon where I explore what the org is currently up to. Is Darius, uh, who is the acting sort of uh, Fleet Admiral Fat, or is the Fleet Admiral. Uh, he operates in my space, in my place. Um, him and the team are building some fantastic quality stuff on the DU server. So I want to go off and show that. See that. Uh, when is the main series coming up? Uh, so I've got a video coming out soon. Hopefully this week, probably next week, actually. Now already halfway into this week. Um, I'll be discussing what's up with Frontier and what the new next series will be. So keep an eye out for that probably next week. I'll be doing like a sit down vlog one uh, where we discuss some stuff and show off some concept, I think. Uh, I wish I could play this game. It looks so cool. They have free fly the weekend. So um, usually once or twice a year, isn't it, Chris? There is a free fly uh, event yeah. where um, you can log in. Uh, like November time is a good one for free fly. Um, that's when Star Citizen has its anniversary. And they put on like a big mm. showing game of all the different ships and you can rent them for a day and they normally do a free fly around then uh, i'm trying to think when else they do free fly so they do them in the summer sometimes as well um so just keep an eye out on the website if you want to give it a go for free fly events and i know a lot of news publications like for gaming also say when star citizen is doing a free fly mm. it's definitely worth checking out when there's a free fly weekend although the biggest thing with this game is install it on an SSD, otherwise you're going to struggle with it a lot. It makes a massive difference. I see time is slowly uh, EVAing towards us. Hello. I'm coming to the front airlock, I'll meet you there. Okay, got it. <sighs> yeah, sorry, I was, just, I was just eating my Snickers and I just fell out, it's weird. Um, you're actually eating a Snickers? Uh, yeah, actually, because I'm not me when I'm hungry. Get yeah, out. No. Bring that turd around. <laughs> You're not welcome here anymore. I thought it was not got a shot, Captain. I mean, I have a shot. No, no, no. I swear to, I swear to God. Well, you. you I mean, you're like an shot. alcoholic. <laughs> what? Every time he says I have a shot, I keep thinking he means drinking. You go for a drink, I know tomorrow. You're worse than any of us. I'm pretty sure if you Oops. kill me and you get a crime stat, the the station will just fire on all of you. It will, yeah. Uh, quite possibly, yeah. So that, oh, yeah. one thing that they updated oh dear. Um, is that now if someone in your group kills you or commits a crime against you, you have the option to press charges or not. So earlier, when me and Time were playing, my ship randomly blew up after I disconnected. And it said that Time blew up my ship, and Time had a notification that I committed homicide against him. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> um. What, are, you, are you out here with me now? Um, no. I just fell out the airlock. He's going okay. swimmingly. <laughs> I thought I'd open the airlock door for you. Uh, there we go. I kind of just like tripped over the airlock like door and oh, fell out. Oh, <laughs> yeah, and I just basically face planted the door. But it's all right now. I'm standing at the entrance for you. Yeah, time going nice and slow. And then you shouldn't fall over. Hello, Anson. I just need the desk again. Careful. Steady. Steady. I'm good. Nice, if you can see all those doors, that'd be great. Yep. Right, get in the turret. <laughs> How does one steal the door? I'll do it from a bridge. Go get in your turret. Yeah. Yeah. So how far away is this thing? Where's the, where's the upper turret again? You can steal the interior oh door, you lazy git. Oh, well, I don't know how to steal the doors. Well, hover over it. You can at least seal the bloody airlock. There we go. It's fine. It's it's added... Heck in Egypt. <laughs> So the only turrets that are free are the front left or rear right. Oh, okay. And uh, is, someone, is someone on the top then? Yeah, I'm on the top. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll go for the front then. All right, let me know when you see. I'm flying course. Got it. Open door. All right. Oh, okay, I'm in my seat. Uh, clear route. Jack, did you get the mission I shared with everyone? Yes, I did. I've currently got it. Um. Uh, it's one of the mining claims, isn't it? There we go. Yeah. Near Hurst, is that near Hurston? Yeah. Yeah, it's Hurston Elf. No, sorry, Crusader Elf. So I think that is near Hurston. Yeah, it is. I'm. Yeah. That's yeah. one of the back turrets. Oh well. Potato, potato. Right, are you sat down. You're sat. Yep. Yep. Let me vote. Yeah, look up. I'm next to you, Dan. Hello. You shouldn't have your th pow thing powered on. <laughs> the turret. We're outside. It doesn't matter. No, we can power it on. You're right on that? Yeah, power on. Yeah. It was only in 
Oh, okay. if you risk yeah, clipping it to the hanger and the door. Because it sticks yeah. out when I tower them. Hmm. No, it's as soon as you get in, it sticks out. Is it a good time to save the engines when engaged? <laughs> um, scroll wheel. Class limit. Yeah. Also, oh, uh, yeah, it is. Good point. Yep. Yep. We're just going to skim that station ever so slightly. Uh -oh. Takes wing off. <laughs> I just go fly off. Oh, that is very close there. Fucking hell. Yeah. <laughs> These things even technically have wings. Like, if you take the turrets away, it's a bit. <laughs> oh, he's one way to find out. Are we moving? Yes. Yes. Uh oh. Stand by for quantum well, jump. Well, GG. Uh -oh. What's happened oh, now? Yeah. I'm still stuck in place. Oh, or at least on my screen it is. You might, you might, uh, when we come out of quantum, you might resync up. Yeah. Do you agree, so Chris? Don't touch anything and it'll be, it'll um, be fine as long as you don't touch anything. And buy it for quantum jump. Oh, here we go. Copy that. Oh, fucking hell, we just knocked it out of our yeah. line. Oh, it's in oh, oh, fucking As soon as you went into quantum. That just smacked me out of the thing. What the? It did. It's only a short jump. Oh. Oh, are we? Oh. You were jumping around the planet. Yeah, that, was, that, was, that was very, that's very underwhelming, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of Star Trek shit is that? I was flying up from the planet with time, and I got distracted, so I was typing on like Discord, I think. And by the time I got back to paying attention to Star Citizen, we did a quantum jump of all of eighty kilometers. Nice. Yeah. I actually had to travel. I didn't need to get to Port Chesler. Yeah. At least the um, quantum jump between planet, like atmosphere and space, now. Is a lot more convenient. Like you don't have to track up like forty thousand, you know, km to yeah. actually get somewhere. Yeah. Uh, so on Hurston and um, Macrotech, which was the planet that we were just above, um, it's about thirteen thousand meters. You need to be up. Right, we're on course, by the way. Cool. Yeah, it's about thirteen thousand meters. You need to be up to engage quantum, which is quite nice. Yeah, it's a little bit more convenient now because it means you're not like lagging behind so much to try and get there. Well, and also, you can just. Years, <laughs> Sure. You can just point at the station to get straight into space, which really speeds things up. I suppose the crowd's out in there. Yeah, he didn't want to come along tonight for some reason, so I'm not sure why. This is a niche one. Yeah. I'm sorry. He was invited. He was. The, le record. the legal record. <laughs> he was clearly invited. Yeah, so I built a new desk today. Um, it wasn't too bad, though. You know when things recommend you build it with two people? Yeah, this mm -hmm. thing you definitely could have done with two people because lifting it, basically the whole like top of this is it's not it's probably some form of wood meat plastic meat metal, and uh, it's about 180 centimeters width lies, and uh, it's fucking heavy to pick up. Put it back where. Jeez. It's about done my backing. It does look good. Jesus. Oh my god. Can you hide the chat, by the way? That's F12. Thank goodness. There you go. Yeah, I always hide it because, uh... <laughs> well, there's usually some people saying some questionable stuff in there, so I'm like, let's hide that one. <laughs> well, today it was all in French. French? Yeah. French? Baguette? Uh -huh. <laughs> That's slightly offensive, but alright. Chat, how are we doing? If you've got any questions on Star Citizen, anything you'd like us to discuss, uh, feel free to type them into the chat, and we shall get them answered. Is we're going to be in quantum space for a little bit of a while, so... Uh, yes. Yeah, it doesn't have the fastest quantum drive in the world. And my camera seems to be stuck slightly left, even when I use the uh, Z to reposition it. I just lock myself in a yeah. cinematic mode because it's easy to travel like this and it looks beautiful as well. I hope we just don't get interdicted. Doing the same. Yeah. I wish it would be. They're pretty what in the f rare these days. What's that turret doing on the back? What in the hell? Okay, apparently I'm going up and down now. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> my axes have changed. Oh yeah, now I'm stuck a little bit to the right. Yeah, it does it when you're in quantum, in the turrets. In this version. This version. This version of the game. Okay, uh, where are we off to then? The mission location. <laughs> where the big marker is, mate. We're going for a picnic, mate. Oh, lovely. Are we having helmets or no helmets? You can take uh, your helmet off if you like. We'll just pick it up in the airlock. Are we just going to be having double dogs? Is that the thing? That's the plan. Yeah, we're just gonna go sit on an asteroid and eat double dogs. Hell yeah. The challenge is to do it without dying. Mm. Well, I mean, I've already died twice, so you know. It's mm. going well. 
I'll tell you what though, my frame rate is much better in this version. Mine's oh, probably yeah. at 36. Like, well, so I'm I'm playing on a 144 hertz monitor and I'm at 140. <laughs> That's not too bad, yeah. Yeah. And it's even better in 3.12.1 because they've removed um, Levski and Delamar and the people who've played it have said, yeah, the servers are so much more stable. And they're old planets, aren't they? So Yeah, they're, they're nasty on. Because those, those planets are meant to be in the system, are they? Yeah, so Delamar is meant to be in the Nix system, which is the system that's connected to Stanton in the law. The only reason it was put in was because it was a simple landing zone they could put in for pirates. Yeah. When planets first became a thing. So that's why it got put in. Oh, no. Um, they always plan to move it out, just not this soon, but with stuff like like moving it out, they freed up resources for like the Xeno Threat event. And How is the, um, the next system Pyro, isn't it? That's the one that's like there, isn't it? Because uh, that was demoed. Is it a year or two ago it was demoed? Yeah, so that was demoed when they demoed the Carrick just before that came out. Point, didn't they? The yeah, case. so with that, I, we're probably not going to see it until next year because they need server meshing for that. And that's there's still no in way, under heavy development. Yeah, there's no way they can do it without server meshing and that on their progress tracker says like towards the end of this year, but we'll see where they get to that because yeah. that's without a doubt a massive project. I'm looking forward to that. It's going to be like a really good feature. Now. I imagine like for like missions and stuff to explore when that comes out, that's going to be really fun. Yeah. I can't yeah, wait for that stuff. And uh, the shoot, so the company that produces all their website and stuff, yeah. Uh, CIG who makes Star Citizen um, have actually given them that they've invested in them and given them the money to start a new studio that will be exclusively producing planets for Star Citizen. Okay, so that'd be now, interesting. So they're confident in their tools and their design pipeline for planets that they can hand them off to a third party. That shows good sign. Like I'm obviously very critical about development. I, I do like hate the time it takes, but I understand you game development is not a linear process. But that is a good sign that things are progressing rather well, because if they were willing to hand it off to another studio, hopefully they've learned the lessons of handing stuff off to other studios. I mean, CIG themselves have developed like a template in a while. It's like me when I do templates to my editors, I go, here's a template. Now you just, you know, put the bits in there and make it and go for it and, you know, do your own thing. That's how it works. Like, I think the last time was it they handed stuff off was of the arena commander and um what's the fps thing called again oh, star marine yeah they handed it off to a studio which then fell through the really badly because uh, i think it's illophonic they handed it over to one of them maybe I and it just remember. it never worked properly but hopefully this time um hopefully this time you know it's going to work really well hopefully he says yeah uh, so like the two main technologies that we're waiting for with star system is called, one's called iCache which is essentially the servers storing your information centrally rather than just on the server. So we've, we're starting to see that trickle in uh, the reputation system that's in the game with 3.12. So that's like you're tracking for bounty authorizations and stuff. So that's part of iCache. That's mainly like persisting your data over different sessions. Hmm. We're seeing bits and pieces of it here already. Uh, the inventory system in your suit persists across sessions, which is quite nice. So my suit is stocked full with food and water, <laughs> in case. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I see a stand, I'd like buy at least one. I remember the last time we attempted recording this, we went to, um, I think it was New Babbage's like, area, wasn't it? And we just bought like hot dogs, cake, yeah. water, like Coke Everything. and stuff like that. Yeah. And then obviously the hammer blew up when we entered the system and that was a waste of like three hours and that video never got aired because my Christ, was it a pain in the ass to do? Hopefully we should be better now. Cross fingers, everyone. If we come out this jump and hit an asteroid, I'm ending the stream because sod that. <laughs> We're not doing it again. I've jinxed it. Don't have any wood to touch. Oh, with the shelves are wood, technically, aren't there? There we go. Forgot about that. She's just too thick. Captain. Well, as long as you've got your constellation ready to go, Jake, I've got mine as well. We can just pile into two constellations instead. That's true. I, I quite like the constellation. Is just you know have one person run and the other person try and blow it up. Yeah. I think we should all we can, just get into dragonflies and just go at it. We'll Jack, what's your way. opinion on homesteads? I have no idea what you mean. Do you mean homesteads in Germany homesteads, or is that something in Star Citizen? What are we on about? A little bit of context I'm would go nicely. In Star Citizen, I imagine. Oh, okay. Is that, I don't know, tell me about that. What, what is that? I, I don't really know, because... Oh. Like, <laughs> Fuck, we? Yeah, we're going to give you the ability to claim land and make your own homes. Because that was when the Pioneer was announced, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. You can, like, play spaces is the idea, anyway. I like that idea, because that means orcs could have a more permanent foothold. I imagine at some point, when this universe is complete, so by the time we're all retired, um, you know, we're going to be able to claim space and, like, wage wars with orcs. So if anything, 
have a child now and name him the successor to your org if you're a dictatorship, like Redwood, because therefore, you know, <laughs> someone will succeed me when I'm dead and can't play the game anymore. I joke, I joke, but if that turns out to be true, we're going to be very, uh, very... <laughs> Jack, watch your headset. I use a Corsair Aversio, I believe it's called. Um, so, yeah. I like this new desk. The only thing I've noticed is there's, like, a bar underneath it where it's, like, keeping it together. And uh, when I sit, I can, like, touch it, like, within an inch of my knee. I'm like, I'm going to hit my knee on this about 60 fucking times this year. Oh, yeah. I can already feel it now. But what good thing is that I can't bring my leg up to, like, sit on my like, legs, which is a good thing, though, because it's unhealthy for me to do that. It'll help me no, in some ways. Right now. Yeah, but I, I spend all day sat down, though. That's true. Uh, there we go. Character reset has been successfully saved. Did you just reset your character now? No, I'll, I'll just save the page. Oh, okay. <laughs> get back in quickly. <laughs> yeah, don't get that next time it happens. Yeah, there are some patches where you can play fine, and there's some patches where you can't play fine, and it, it's dependent on each patch for each person. Yeah. 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 It's just luck of the draw. Yeah, for me, men out, by the way. yeah, for me, new Babbage is basically cursed, so that's fun. <sighs> it's but, my favorite planet to fly around, don't worry. But, yeah, as I've said many times, my god, does this look good for an alpha? It's just like, yeah, really they're, they're taking it from the Paris. Something I always enjoy is when I come back patch to patch and the little changes in the UI. Like, I know it sounds like Ooh, a yes, really yeah. tiny thing, but it shows that actually, like, functional development is happening, not just the behind-the-scenes yeah. stuff that we see. It, like, it, yeah, stuff. Uh, we're 0.5 mil out. So yep, we're about to about. I'm just quickly turning. That okay. video. Doink, Scoobs! I'm a Scooby Doo impression. All right. Here we go. Oh, it's a cloud. I haven't been wow. in one of these yet. Oh yeah, that was something else they introduced, the guest cloud tech. The volumetric clouds. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh. Right, uh, F4 mode. Oh, I think the alien like, mission um, Yeah, the Xeno threat mission takes place in a gas cloud. Uh, so Dude's not shooting! Like... <laughs> you know who's out there? <laughs> this is like the start of them developing the tech for the Crusader landing zone, which is going to be on a gas drone. Ooh, that'd be nice. Because yeah, yeah, Crusader's yeah, the central thing, isn't it? Uh, Crusader is the planet that Paul Polisar is around. Yeah, yeah, or well, Gas Giant in this case, yeah. 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 Technically, yeah, Pyro was heavily, like, clouded around as well. Hmm, at least found a jump gate. Yeah. Isn't it? It's do you know the. I just find. That's odd. That's which I've just went offline. <laughs> do you come to take it personally now, Owen? That was odd. Owen? What? Yeah. On some drive, yeah, just. There's an imposter. Did your drive just pooped? Yeah. Drive just went offline. It's, uh... it's the curse. The curse uh -oh. is coming. I can't get the dashboard to display. <laughs> get out of your seat and back in again. Can you stop yeah. shooting? If you accidentally hit something, we're up shit creek. Oh god, am I gonna hit? Just you don't shoot anyway! <laughs> <laughs> you have to hold down um, Y to get out your seat now rather than just pressing it. Oh, okay. Is that yeah. why the ship's now depowered? Yep. Alright. If it's depowered, you probably hit you or something. Oh, what's this? Which is okay. It's fine. You've also opened up uh, the missile bays. Have I? They are turned automatically. Oh, okay. Yeah, you have to manually close them. Yeah, it seems a bit of a flaw. This ship have a self destruct yeah. sequence. Yes, uh, don't use it. <laughs> oh, yikes. Oh, yikes. Okay. What are you yikesing about? Shield and back into charge as well. Just, yeah, I know. Just oh, for a moment, all the armor on the ship disappeared, and it was just. It's <laughs> <laughs> a proton molecule back around here again. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's just what happens when you plan a hard drive. Yeah. <laughs> Still to get that. The floor back online. Can you, what size of hard drive are you on now? This question. My two terabytes. What are you eating that's as well? That's my question. A whole fish. A whole fish. A whole. A, a raw fish you just caught while we were. A goldfish. Goldfish? Are you eating like your goldfish? goldfish? You're eating your goldfish. Why the snack? Why does the drive keep You're disabling? On my goldfish. I swear yeah. goldfishes are like dog treats. For some reason, the drive keeps going offline. Do you want somewhere else to try? You need an engine. When I, whenever I lock onto the thing and it charges 100%, it then cuts out. What's the space yeah. version of AA? 
Alcoholics Anonymous? <laughs> no. Should I also jump? <laughs> I thought you'd say also glass. I need to hear the thing in seconds to be quiet. Yeah, it's scanning behind. Can I lock or? I'm gonna quickly try just, yeah. rejoining because the ship is still stuck in place for me after we got out of the jump point and you guys are like off five kilometers. That's that. Yeah, we got a glitch yeah, on the bridge. It's a glitch. I'll try again. Mm -hmm. Oh, B, I am holding B, maybe that's how you bring it up, but it's not like locking B. properly. Well, you push B to bring it up and then hold B to go, but... Yeah, that's what I mean, but it, it keeps yeah. cutting out, essentially. Yeah, it is. It can be really buggy like that. To be fair, we could just fly over there. Yeah, yeah, it'll take a while. A... It's only 100 kilometers. To be fair, though, we might as well fly in that direction. Yeah, I, was, yeah. I brought it down while I got out. Yeah. So it doesn't spiral out of control. Not a good show, I guess. 100k out. Yeah, we just, we okay, just it's come back online out. since I got in. Cool. And bye. Oh, there we go. Oh, Jesus. That was here. Situation report. Uh, I think I see a ship. Wild Bob. Okay, for this, we need to locate and destroy the sentries, and there'll be ships around trying to shoot us as well. Um, if you use the scanning mode, Jack. So that's press tab. Yep, got it. Remotes, you'll send out pings, and it will help direct us to where we need to go. Can you remind me of my missile button, please? Uh, middle mouse. Thank you. How do I lock target? Um, it's press the lock and then hold to fire. Okay. Uh, okay. T to target. What port? What yeah, port? Nine my port side is uh, a pink marker. I just that one. Oh. Is that the giant's cube? Yes. Yeah, giant. <laughs> the poor <Yeah>, cube! <laughs> and then when you get more in towards it, you can send out uh, more scan pulses and it will get smaller. Oh. Okay. A bit drift on it's it. It's used a lot for mining. <laughs> yeah, definitely. It's really nice to have it displays on screen now. Mm. Okay, I'm Jack. How are you? I'm good, thank you. What kind of ship do you have? I'm currently flying the Hammerhead. It's the Aegis Hammerhead, and it is quite nice. We got this one back uh, during one of the sales, and um, yeah, we don't have a chance to use it very much yet. Because the last time we tried, it blew up. <laughs> the other ships are lovely, but this one's just full combat, which is great. <laughs> I, I wanted to get the Idris when it was on sale, but I just didn't feel like spending... Uh, not, is it Idris? Yeah, it's just, it's just a figure, yeah. isn't it? There's the Idris last time you tried to get. But it sold out pretty much instantly. Yeah, yeah literally. Like, I was going to consider buying it because I thought, you know, if it's a future investment, etc. Oh, misfire. Mm -hmm. Go down! I will go under it. Oh, it seems to have directed us towards some rocks. I didn't realise this ship could scan mineables. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. I head towards the search area again. Yeah. Oh, background. Yeah, we cannot shoot the rocks. Oh, you're not, not going to do anything by shooting the rocks. Something to shoot. Uh, it might be worth, by the way, if we're fighting smaller things. Don't over to stack it, right? Yeah, and don't overheat your guns. Yeah. I'm like, how can you play Volcanoids? No, it's a game I need to take a look at at some point. I feel bad every time the guy messes you on Twitter about that, I keep forgetting to respond. Speaking of which, I've just forgot to respond to somebody else today. I'll get around to that. Clear success. Contact. Contact. Don't yep. got, uh, left side. 10k out. Uh, there's four on our... Your left or my oh. left? Oh, up. Uh, up. Up left. Up port side. Oh. Yeah. Right. Bring it about. We have got targets on scanners. Okay. They're 6.6k out. We're still not going to hit them from here, I don't think. And then, yeah. yeah. Here they come. Oh. Okay, yeah, I can hit them. Yeah, I can hit one now. In range. It's our locked. Fire. Oh, I get the notification for that too. Yeah, so. It's out of way. The menu missiles look fantastic. They do. Ooh. That was a hit. Ooh. That was a yeah. nice sound. Got a kill. Oh, shield's yeah. taking damage. There you go, we're getting in. There's a freelancer behind us. Copy. Take it. Engaging. Come on, freelancer's out. Oh. Another what the hell's that? Press case, oh. I mean the uh, mission invite again. Wait, Jesus. We're in the middle of blowing stuff up, though. Yeah, yeah. Kill Emily, so. Owen. Situation report, please. Uh, one enemy right. Ah. Yeah, one left. Zero enemies right. I can neutralize. <laughs> nice. 
Alright, I think if you start scanning now, we should have... If we're close to the search area, that Yep, is. where's the search area? Go on, I've lost... Oh, it's everywhere. We should be able to start trying to find the sentries that we need mm. to kill. My, uh... My house is locked for some reason. Oh, God. Who's shooting? Yeah. I saw a rock that looks... It's my mouse is locked, the corner of the screen. Uh, hold oh. down, uh, Z, and then reposition your camera and let go of Z. Oh, there you go. I have had that happen quite a bit. Yeah, it Can you happen. send it again? Uh, right bracket didn't respond. Or left bracket, I mean. Right, well, that's the last time I'm there. <laughs> there we go. Right, first scan. Scanning area! Copy. I love that doing the scan bumps your IR like it's no tomorrow. Oh, um, I don't think that's it. No, those are the rocks, aren't they? Yeah, yeah that's 11k Wait, that one seems to have a different marker. There's two no, search areas directly in front of us. Uh, no, those are the rocks we saw. Oh, right, they're still there. Okay. Yeah. I guess if we just fly around this area. It's a noise, though. Yeah. I have the ping, yeah. What are we it's looking for? Uh, sentries. They're like turret yeah. placement type. Yeah, things. yeah. And there should be more enemies around. Okie dokie. If you fly towards like rocks and stuff, we should find some. Head in this direction. Um, no. Mm. Ripperoni. So, how's people day going? Um, hello, animation. Hello, hello. How do I get started? How expensive? You need to head up to Robert Space Industries. That's the website. Um, expensive is up to you. You can get starter packs or small ships, or you can get more expensive stuff. It depends what you want. Do you research before you think of getting it? Uh, it's always advised that because Star Citizen is a heavy in development game. Also, be aware the starter ships of the game on like the basic packages are pretty terrible. They they don't give you a real representative experience of the game. Cool. Um, I'm getting like a little ping notification on like my screen. Oh. It's like a little. It's like a little marker, like a circle with like a little stick coming out of it. It's showing me... Oh no, that might be just centralizing me, actually. Yeah, that might be just centralizing me. Never mind, move along. Is that a new thing pinging over there? I don't know. I think it is. The 20k out? Yeah, that's a new thing. Yeah. Gonna scan us again. Because the... Contacts! Contacts on sensors! Wait, 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 wait. Multiple contacts approaching. Head ahead. They've just popped up in my sensor, and I'm getting a red warning light on the hull for some reason. Yep, there we go. It's Prospector. Got nothing. Yeah, oh, we're we're I think our radars aren't as good as yours. 13 oh, km in front of us. Yeah, yeah. There, there, we there we go. There we go. Yeah, our radar's not as good on the Sarks. Well, attack mode. Seems like 11k is our one. Stand by to fire on my command. Copy. Copy it. 8.5. 7.9 Old Alright, well It's all away One down Next one oh, I like how they've, um, they've added like the auto gimbal type thing to these turrets Two down So you can relatively aim Contact from above, got good. him yeah, nice. Nice. Nicely done, that. gents This ship is a beast when it wants to be yeah, it's great for taking out smaller ships. Let's scan. Just count 14k. I've got another one to 18k to our right. Let's do the right one here. Yeah, the 14k one is the rock scan. Heading this location. Let's go check it out. It's below the asteroid. It looks like it could be it. Chris, any idea, idea what we're searching for? Uh, they just like turret emplacements. Okay. Keep it on that case. Uh, way. isn't there a designation system? Uh, what do you mean? Says so what you mean, chat. I'll ram into the rock, Jack. Uh, you can ping targets and label them as one, two, or three. Can you still, can you pin them? Uh -oh. I know you used to be. Oh, oh fuck! Oh, oh, God. No. Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> I thought it would take a bit more of a brunt of that damage, to be honest, but I guess not. Yikes. What did you impact? An asteroid. Wait, He's only going about 100. I thought it would, like, you know, dent the ships, kind of, but not fucking kill it. So where's it going to drop us now? Wait back at, um, uh, I, I, I don't know if it'll flash a Brimhex, but I don't know. 
It should be back at um, Tresla. Right. The engines on a hammerhead aren't very good. I'm going to say it's that now. Engine, no, they're not. The forward, uh, the forward, you know, getting up is fine, but, you know, slowing down, not so much. That's a bit shit. So, before we started, I said who would be the first to crash. Well, I'm, I'm the one flying. <laughs> but the thing is, he took us all with us. I know. Mm -hmm. yeah. all of us. So we still got to go and destroy the sentries. That's the plan. Uh, so what are we getting in to go over there now? We could take both constellations. Yeah, I think that's um, the best option. Oh, it's my yeah. eyes. I do, really. The other option that. is... Uh, how many of us are there? Um, six. Six. Six of us, so the Connies take, what, three, oh, three each? Yeah, three each. That sounds like a good idea. Let's do that. I was already on my way with the uh, Shrike. Well then, turn your ass around. <laughs> Get back around, yeah. Uh, I think I'm on Hesler and I? Yeah. Yeah, I'm on Tresla. I'm just coming oh, I can't get out of the bed. Yeah, same. <laughs> oh, nice. Uh, Reach, you can come join me. You can be in my exo. Gotcha. Help me. Help, I can't get up. And then when we blow up these ships, we can go for the carrack and get that blown up. Oh god, I then we can blow up my carrack. <laughs> yeah, then we can blow up Chris's carrack. <laughs> uh, Chris, That's the plan. To... Chris, we may need to restart our games. Yeah, I'm gonna relog. Yeah, I'm gonna relog. Oh boy. boy. So See you in a minute. As well. I might go for a joyride in my arrow while we wait. Go for it. I'll bring a con in just because it's sad. I'll go in the joyride in my Gladys. Oh wait! I'm not gonna die. Hmm? Retrieve. That's right. It wasn't the enjoyment I was talking about. It's a Constellation Aquila. That's the one that's uh, got the exploration stuff on it. Oh, yeah. the, uh, with the wider front. Yeah, yeah the Andromeda. It's got more of a curved front in a way because obviously it's yeah. designed to be looking out of. Wait, I always like that one. My character, that's what I had. Gross. Great ships, to be honest. Time. You were hosting the mission, yeah? Yeah. Wouldn't it, would it not? Cool? I don't know because I shared it to one of you. And if I'm logging back into the same server. Yeah, it should just drop him back in. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, obviously, logging in. saying sentries destroyed percent LS, anyways. That you, Edo, just tried stepping in. Yeah. All right. I'm in here. Oh, okay. Oh, oh I shit you are. Pen Sentries destroyed percentage LS. Yeah. That's, yeah, it's a Maybe bug with it. Is it a bug for the display or a bug with the thing? I think it's a bug with the display, sure. typically. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. We can go around searching for the Sentries and the Connies, and then if not, we can go find something. They're a little bit easier to control. Yeah. And they stop yeah. a lot quicker. Which is, when I play this game, I get used to the Hotas controls when I come to, like, you know, mouse and keyboard. It's a lot different anyway. Yeah. Did you, uh... Did you press the hanger button? Yeah. Okay. No. Oh, Making a sweet ass time, yeah. Is my helmet the one without the hole? It is, yeah, cool. <laughs> Not when you just gaffer taped over. This is one of those situations where I can't, I, like, I know it's been like one of the earliest things they decided they were going to do, but yeah. um, the Merlin docking and undocking thing for the Connie. Oh, it'd be great, wouldn't it? Because we could literally deploy yeah. that in this type of mission and you, know, you yeah. scatter it's around. on the road map and they're confident it's going to come out soon. Well, the actual are docking and undocking. Yeah, it's like docking is slated for next patch, I believe. That's, That's a big thing for Squadron 42 as well, isn't it? Hop on, Reed. Yeah. So, and they've been talking it up. So we'll see. I love the constellations like um, blue lights, like it's not ready to start yet. It has been a, such a long time since I walked on this ship. I can't remember why I named it. I think it's a sentinel I named this one now. Mm. Uh, I'm going to just jump right in the turret. Go for it. Welcome to Robert Space Industries. Do they have right, the Or is it still the old style? Um, I think it's in fish style. I can't remember what the freaking button of style is. I love the power up sound. Do I need to request takeoff permission on here or not? No, uh, you don't. You can just take off. Yeah, not for the outer pad. When you get a certain distance, so it's away, it'll go. Like, thanks for the pleasant stay or something. Yeah. Gross piece of. We gotta park over here under the station. Cool. That way, uh, someone can come fly to us when they're back in. Chris, sorry, you have one of the uh, correct pads. No, I'm calling my ship now. Okay. At least this thing's a bit more nippy as well. It is, yeah. I do, I do really like it. I really like the Connie. It's just I wanted something bigger. <laughs> no, yeah, I agree. I'd, I'd get a character if I wanted it, but I'd rather save up and get you know, a capital ship because that's kind of my thing. 
Oh, no, absolutely. I'm just never going to get... I'm not going to get one of them. So yeah. Yeah. Well, the thing with the Connie is that it's great if you're doing combat solo because it has the four size four gimbaled weapons. Yeah. And they're just... I've not found anything that can match it. No, if you swap into um auto gimbal track thing... Yeah. And then just let them kill everything in the path. <laughs> It is great. And uh, I've got them upgraded to laser repeaters as well, and it's like an extra 300 DPS per gun. Sorry, Jack, are you firing? No, no, it's Check. fine, it's fine. Just realise what that button does. Maybe don't do that. You're going to burn them all before we need them. All right. Still doing I, don't know what it's, I don't know what it's doing. Why won't it stop? There you go, it looks like it stopped. The server appears to be full, so I'll just wait and see if it opens up. Why have I got like a ton of alerts on my dashboard? <laughs> um... Hey, Leon, even though it says the server's full, still click the button anyway. Um, yeah, I have. Maybe it was not working. Why does it sound like... Yeah, it's, it's picking more. up turrets um, and stuff around it. It likes picking up my scanner for some reason. All right, gotcha. Okay, gotcha. And what I was looking uh, to do, I was looking to close the bloody fans, but I couldn't remember what fucking key bind it was. It's not N. K. K, okay, I've just deployed a landing gear. Whoops. Yeah. K, K. Yeah, so, K is there you go. These in the combat is likely going to result in those uh, VTOL pylons on the front coming off. But... Yeah, so I've sealed it anyway because why have it opened by default in space? I have no idea. They, do, they are a good feature, but. It's just default for the ship that it's easier to take off with. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to go AFK for five seconds while we, uh, while we do this. That's fine. Chat, how are we doing? That well, eh? <laughs> That's some uh, humidity crash. Exactly. Things are not good. Part is even worse. To be honest, I've not played Star Citizen in like four months, so. Um... Well, Storm Idris with his S10 Railgun looks better. I mean, I've seen people have been stealing Idris and stuff in-game, which is quite fun. That sort of, like, gameplay is really interesting, I find. Thank you, Star Citizen. What's it spawned me without my helmet on. <laughs> and then it took forever to equip it, so I suffocated. Hooray. Hooray. It's not a bug, it's a feature. Do-do, do-do, do-do. Star Citizen! <laughs> it's an alpha update page. You asked for it, you got it. Doing fine here, fantastic. I'm just checking our Discord. If you want to use our Discord, by the way, it's discord.gg slash Captain Jack. Uh, it's not YT, it's just Captain Jack. You can come join there. It'll really be fantastic. Which hour, uh, am I going to? Uh, do you want to come on board my ship or go to Chris? Uh, I don't mind. My ship's at pad 11. Go to Chris because someone would have to uh, have these holes to me. Or, you know, um, spacewalk. Uh, I can't okay. spacewalk because uh, I've got my, um, what's called Dragonfly. I can fly with you. If you want. Here we go. I'm loading in. You can put the hey. uh, dragonfly inside the cargo bay of the uh, Connie. Hey. Cool. Yep. Should we see if we can take that? Uh, don't try it. <laughs> don't try it. The dragonfly is a bit of a pain. Because of how it's hover system. Oh works. yeah, that one. <laughs> and um, knowing this game. Also with the Connie as well, it takes some damage. The cargo bay comes open a bit. So I can Good imagine. Yeah. Are you sure yeah. it's pad eleven because pad eleven is empty. It it will say by the marker for the ship. Oh god! It did say pad eleven. It might have got stored. Looks like it. I'm just sat here. I may have just have. This is now a two-man mission. Do we abandon these fools? <laughs> Set course for the frontier. Let's go. <laughs> I mean, ship, Chewy. A very large ship. Oh, no. Well, I don't know if I trust you as a pilot. If you don't crash a starship once in your life, are you really a captain? I mean, look at Captain Kirk. He blew up a frigging Enterprise. Okay, Owen, oh, it's it. definitely on pad 11 now. Okay, now it but is. By that logic, Graz is a captain and we can't have that. And he's an idiot. There's a difference. You're not wrong. <laughs> I tend not to be. That's what I do. I drink wine and I know things. I drink a day, dude. <laughs> Great impression. Thank you. Deep working on it. No, well, yeah, you know, I've got to have party tricks to pull out. I'm not very interesting, so. <sighs> <laughs> All right. That's a bit depressing. So depressing. Life is depressing. It really is, isn't it? No. Come on, put your helmet on. Just waiting for my catch up to, to update. Oh. Uh, right, let me just edit something. Because I've been... Leon, have you been able to get in yet? It's still loading. 
Okay. The cons of having it on a hard drive. Yeah. Got well, as long as you're loading and not on trying to get into yeah. the server. Yeah. Got to get yourself an M.2, my friend. True. Or just an SSD. Tapped out yeah, while spinning with ship. Sorry. <laughs> oh, great. I chanted it all over my turret. Yeah. <laughs> There we go. Problem solved. <laughs> I don't remember doing not to do that in future. So here's a question, right? How do you determine up in space? Which way the space station's pointing? Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, nice. I see you put attritions on all of your hard points, Chris. Yeah. Right, chat. So this is a bridge of a constellation. You can see a lovely view at the front. It's one of the reasons why I like the constellation, and it inspired the eclipse as well. So that you can just see this beautiful area out there. And obviously, the bridge itself. Very compact. I do wish the other light cockpits had something to do. Hopefully in the future they are, uh, because having co-pilots like operate missiles or you know manage shield systems, something like that, it could be a good idea. Just there's not really much for a co-pilot to fully do just yet. So hopefully also, uh, they need to change it so the co-pilots get more than one screen each, because as a pilot you get loads of screens. Yeah. Whereas as a co-pilot you get like one, and that's it. Mm. In here we've got sort of a crew area. So there's like lockers, a bathroom there, the elevator I'm sitting there is an airlock. Uh, the table comes up the floor here, so we, we can deploy the table, I think. I, think, oh, I can yeah, sit down, yep. Yeah. Sometimes the table deploys, sometimes not. You get the gist, though. It's pretty good. And I think there's more closets and stuff over here. This is a bunk bed. I believe these are meant to operate as escape pods in the future, aren't they? Yeah, I think so. I can enter the bed here. Very nice. Ta-da! The giant armor I'm currently wearing. A bit OTT. <laughs> Does Connie have weapon racks? Uh, I don't know. Is it one of the ships that didn't get one? I don't think it does. I think it's too hard. That's a shame. So... Whoops. That was a close one. Almost click log out. Oh, no, I did click log out. Whoops. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> sake. I start us not responding. Yeah. Welcome to reasons why we don't cover this game very often. <laughs> it's a bit of a pain. God, was going Jesus. Jesus. Jacket and asteroid. Oh, hang on. The worst part about this is now Jack's not here. I can't get out of the. Uh, no, what a shame that is. <laughs> Lieutenant <laughs> Reed. <laughs> oh, I'm demoting you in the next series. Don't you dare. I'm having you shot on sight. You've done that many times. Mutiny! Mutiny? You'll become a rival. Oh, oh god. Oh. I'm in. I oh, if you make your way down to pad 11. Okie day. Oh, I've got to click the spam here for the bloody button to join the game. Yes, I will do that as soon as the hallway becomes uh, do you want... um, a hallway. Um, if, is the um, ship still there? Oh wait, no, you're going to respawn, aren't you? In this. Yeah, it will still be there because um, Major Concern's still on it. Yeah, I'm in here, but I just can't get out of the turret. And I don't mind being stuck in the turret. Just, I would like someone to be able to fly the ship. <laughs> okay, I'm coming. Da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. Well, I just got to keep right-clicking on you trying to join the server. I find that funny as well. <laughs> yeah, very funny. <laughs> Wait, who's going? What's the station um, I see in the center, by the way? Like in the loading screen at the minute. What's that? Like a big uh, station think... inside a cloud. Oh, the new, the new main. Oh, menu. that's probably just um, a rest stop. I wonder what that is. It looks kind of cool. Is it? What's in the background? Um, it's a big circular station in a way. Like pylons going off there. Look like gas canisters actually inside a cloud of tons of asteroids. It looks like where the exo threat takes place. Not the same station though. It, it, it will be one of the um, rest points where yeah. there's the cloud tech because that's their new big thing, the cloud tech. Yeah. It looks really good. It does. Speaking of cloud tech, Starbase has implemented lots of clouds in their asteroid belt. One big cloud, really. Yeah. Hey Cam Jack, do you like SE or Star Citizen better? Uh, probably Space Engineers, but with two types of different games, you can't really compare them in that regard. But obviously, I play SE more. This is more Sandbox. Oh, hello there. Oh, so really technically is, but... How you doing? Hmm. How you doing? Just, uh, you want to get in here and try... Oh, for God's sakes. I mean, I can try, you know. You know. Uh, wait, uh, can you open the hangar? Let me in. No, I can't. Oh, oh are, you, are, you, oh, are you stuck in I'm there? I'm stuck. I'm stuck in the cockpit, mate. Okay, interesting. I'll, I'll see if I can dismount then. Yeah, I if I power the turret off, it decides to freak out and try and align, but can't. Chris, you said... Which... Yeah. Add 11. 11, all right. Yep. Oh, where am I? Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, where art thou door? 
You guys saw someone in the chat to log off. <laughs> Just tell him to go away. Are you on the top turret or the bottom turret? Top turret. Top turret, okay, so I need to go on the other way then. Any chance you guys can do a prison escape too, but no, maybe. We can't try and did that one to death though, so. Yeah, I think that uh, time was telling me that they've changed it and made it harder. Right, it was already hard enough the first time around. Yeah. With the prison, it's just log out and let the timer run down or go do a, some random job that will get you out. Yeah. It's a good idea having it in the, in the game, though. I don't, the, I get... the mining, by the time you do it, like, it actually goes very quickly. Well, um, they've got, like, actual missions you can take in prison to get out earlier. Yeah, because oh, yeah. I, um, I basically fixed this, like, oxygen thing and it instantly let me out. Oh, well done. So it's just had 13? 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. 11. I was, I was like, oh my god, something's wrong. Where's the airlock? <laughs> I only said it like nine times. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Oh. I'm in the trash room. Where's the airlock? Why is Kraz in the menus? I can join! I can join! Right! <laughs> Woohoo! By the side, what? Yeah, time? so right, there, there are circular things on the sides. Oh, little, little oh, circle doors, oh, you see? Oh, that's called an airlock. There's also one in the top. Up here, I can point out with the turrets okay. and wiggle the arms around so you can That's see. Fine. You got Thank it. You. You, you're gonna you're gonna fall on your face trying to get through. Oh, oh okay, oh, okay. Oh. Well, apparently I can't I, I can't get in it. Ah, oh, Jack, do you I, lock the exterior? I don't know. I'm off screen eating a mini roll. I think That's you might. Totally, have... Am I permanently stuck? Look, I'm not having dinner. Yeah. Leave me alone. This is this is sealed life now. I'm gonna. I'm gonna blow up your dragonfly. <laughs> don't blow up my dragonfly, because <laughs> then you'll get a crime stat. <laughs> True. Uh, Hey Tom, how's it going? Hey, I'm, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna working. get back, I'm gonna get back in my dragon blood. I'm a sentient turret. That's all I've got. <laughs> sentient turret. Okay, I can, I can, I can, I can be here. But hello. Oh my god. Well, is that Kraz in the chat? Kraz, why are you in the chat and not in the game? Hey? Yeah. Come hey. On. Chop chop. Coward. <laughs> this. It looks yeah. that oh come off it. I died. Ah! You managed How did to you do die? That? Did you I forget to put your helmet on? Yeah, yeah you did. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. did. You did. Oh. <laughs> you literally couldn't get more pointless. <laughs> oh, I, I, I nipped off and have a quick mini roll as I'm not eating anything today. Well, eating anything yeah. substantial. Yeah. Well, uh, so good news. We can't get in the. You're ordering McDonald's. Thank you. Uh, yeah, yeah. Have it. <laughs> Go for it. I'll order you McDonald's. What do you want? Uh, you want a Big Mac? I'll get you some salad. Uh, very good, very good. Yeah. You want a milkshake? I'll get you some, some tepid water. Oh, what, what milkshake oh. though? Oh, you know, it's the kind that they. You know when you bleed a radiator. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> That's what you're gonna get. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> this is, I just want the gunge. I mean, the server is full. No, I just joined. That's literally. I'm in the loading screen of Destiny now. What's something you'd want added or removed from Star Citizen? Um, the game. <laughs> you can choose if I have one added or removed. Up to you. Uh, it, it's making progress. It just takes time. All right, okay, I'm back in a seat now. Okay. Okay. I logged off in the bed and it swung me back in a seat. Time, why have you got the dragonfly? So we said don't get it out. No, I, I, I got it to get here. He was coming to rescue. Yeah, we said don't put it in the ship. Yeah. Why are you going away from me? Leon, what, what's your status on getting back to us? I'm coming to the elevators. Have you put your helmet on this time? Yeah. Can't fire. <laughs> I logged back in and I can't fire anymore. Are you going to ram me? Wait, no, I'm not, I'm not blowing up another ship. We talk about ship. Uh, I can, but I'll get a crime step. Oh, okay. Don't talk about ship. All right, time. Okay, stop faffing around and get on board. I'm trying to. You keep moving. Am I? I'm the mission with everyone. Oh, that's because my alignment's gone off, that's why. Uh, can you open the exterior doors, please? Uh, Reed, can you go open the door for him, please? Uh, I can't get out of the turret. Let me power the ship on and off a oh, sec. Wait. Hang on, hang on. Oh, then my game is frozen. I'm out of the turret. Yay! Yay! Chris, 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 although, there you go. There you go. Now that ship's powered 11. on. Like, yeah. <laughs> no, just... Oh, God. I've fallen into the bottom turret. Oh, uh, 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 <laughs> fix the dread. And I'm dead. Okay. Oh, for oh, God's no, sakes. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Hang on. Hang on. No, I'm not. Now, now I am. Now I'm dead. No, I'm not. I'm still alive. I'm phasing in and out of the hole. I'm, I am one with the ship. <laughs> what are you on? Uh, I wish everyone. I am one there. with the ship. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. I, I, I wish people <laughs> thank you, God. I can see you. I can see you. I can actually see. I'm dead. Now I'm dead. Yeah, okay. yeah I can see you oh, falling out the bottom. People. Yeah, there you go. Just feet off from the station. Yeah. Time. You could have parked in a more naff position, could you? Oh, oh, well, 
No one's ever dissed me on my fucking before, so you're my first. Oh, one it's just in the engine pod now. <laughs> Everything's. You're fucking idiot, wrong. you are. You're fucking idiot. <laughs> oh God! Right, that's blown up. Should I just get in a fighter and kill him? What me or time? I don't think some debris floating. Don't ask. Don't ask. Why is it so? Sp what is spinning so much? Captain Jack committed negligent homicide. Press accept to override and file charges. <laughs> what? Hmm. I didn't kill you. Yeah. You killed me. Yeah, you did. Did negligent homicide. You didn't even intend to kill me. You just killed me. Oh, come off it. I can decline it, though, so you don't Thank know. you. Don't That's greatly know. appreciated. You're welcome. You know, a small bribe. Are we on the French know. server, by any chance? There's a lot of French people in chat. Yes. Are you yes, also French? Listen, says my helmet's equipped, but it's not. I read where are you? How did you I'm, die uh, again, Leo? going through the elevators. <laughs> to get back to the thing. <laughs> I guess an airlock will pick it up. He died whilst right. having the helmet on. Yeah, uh, you can oh, see it. The helmet's on. Um, how about we ask permission to land and tell him what? Ah, uh, we'll just wait for him to come to us. Yeah, come to pad 11 and I can give you a lift. Pad 11, okay. Yeah, we can just dock with ships side by side. Yeah. yeah. And we'll just transfer. I've got a lot of highs it was, yeah. Open because Leon keeps dying. <laughs> <laughs> not my fault, I swear it's not my fault! <laughs> Why do you sound so disgusted? Like, ugh. ugh I'm so disgusted. Yeah. The thing is, like, annoyingly, if they had a little med bay on the Connie, we would solve all these problems. That's why I got in the bed, because I thought I could respawn there. And, like, that's why I got in it, but I actually clicked log off, because they, they don't really differentiate the buttons slightly, do they? Yeah, you know, it's, yeah. yeah, it's very easy to do. Sorry, uh, did you say pad 13? <laughs> no, I know it's 11, I'm on my way. Hit me up fire and squad to deck 11 right now. <laughs> oh, I said hangar 5. Oh, okay. All right, I'll go back. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. I dead. The, the elevator. Oh, for God's sakes! No, I didn't. I'm all good. Don't worry. Fuck you! I'm, like I'm not a pleb. <laughs> I mean, it's my fault. The game didn't put it on my head. I don't know what to say. <laughs> you know, it's, your, it's your fault. The game's not finished. It's 300 million spent on this. You know, it's you definitely got to be you. I've contributed at least an amount of money to that, and that's all we're going to say. Yeah, yeah I'm not saying how much money I've spent. Yeah, no. Um, I, do you know what? The problem is, every time I go onto the thing, I'm like, I could just upgrade that. <laughs> yeah, same. And it's it. like, oh, I'm missing this from my fleet. Yeah, literally. I am in the so chairman's club, is all I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, I'm not that bad. Well, basically, I spent the consolation. I get referral rewards, so they go towards nice. it. So naturally, I'm in it because yeah. of that. And obviously, now yeah. I've built the, bought the hammerhead, so yeah, I've definitely in Right, so just uh, shocking news, everyone. I managed to get to the ship, and on the ship, and in the seat, perfectly fine. Well, now we've just got to wait for Leon. Oh, here he's on. He's done. I have not put on. Run. I'm targeting on Leon. <laughs> Are you on the ramp, Leon? Yes. Wait. If I when ready. How are we already down? Oh, I'm not going to ask. Is this game worth it? It's up to you, really. I can't really answer. I think the, the the best way to answer that is when it goes well, you have a great time. Yeah. It's making it go well. The first half hour of a stream, fantastic. The last half hour, not so much. I think kind of the multi crew needs a little bit of work, but like kind of just solo or maybe like like two or three people actually works quite well. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's one of those like you don't really need to like you feel like you need to say it, but it's also a really obvious thing that this game is nowhere near anywhere close to a release version. <laughs> So if you're gonna buy into it, you no matter how much of your hard-earned money you spend on it, you've got to realize that actually it's not gonna work half the time. <laughs> and that's just something you gotta accept, and you can't get mad about it. It's just a meme at this point. It is a bit of a meme, yeah. But I'm telling you, it'll come out when I'm in the nursing home, and it'll be great. Mm -hmm. Right. Diddy. Diddy. All right, I'm heading. Diddy. Diddy. Check. Don't move. All right, I'm sat still. It'll be announced when Bethesda stop releasing Skyrim. Oh no, you'll be able to play Beth uh, Skyrim on your ship in this game. That's all. <laughs> I hope so. Oh, that Did you know that this year it is 10 years since Skyrim released? Is it? Correct. Yeah, I didn't. in November. Like November and that's somebody who's only ever played 6 minutes of Star uh, fucking Skyrim. I don't care. <laughs> it's going to be really brutally honest, sir. <laughs> Fuck Skyrim. <laughs> Do with less of your negative attitude. I don't, it's very old now. It doesn't look very good graphics-wise. I'm so update it, mate. Get a 4K texture pack. Just, just. Like, Never. Or, or I could wait and play Mass Effect in 4K in May. Oh, you could play a good game. There's the other option. Fuck off. Or, or you could wait until sometime. How <laughs> dare game. you, you bitch! Okay, there we go. We should be close enough for a transfer. Then. Okay, I'm. Uh, I'm. Get off my ship, you heretic. Get out. 
I will take you yeah, out. Off please. you go. I will self-destruct this bitch. Please don't. Which Assassination so sequence in five. Oh. I'm in the ship. What was that? Move the ship? No. no, no. <laughs> Roll Another. the ship. Okay. Oh, hi. She I'm outside. Implode. Hello. Oh, hello. Yeah, I don't know where you are because I'm looking at something else. Uh, what's the best way to come up when you're in space on these things? Um, um, use the airlock. Do the elevator. Just use the elevator because it's a bit funky. But... Um, what it'll do is it'll squish your legs. Yeah, yeah. Eventually, but it will get you in gravity quite nicely. Right. There it is. Right. I just whacked my head on the bloody docking collar. Okay, you want to be very careful. Yep. That wasn't nope, very careful. Oh god! Oh god! I'm on my knees. Oh no! Oh god. And uh. You'll be pleased to know I am stood up, all is well, and I'm sitting <laughs> in my upper turret, and I'm staying there. Okay, Ooh. good. Have we still got a mission, Chris? Yeah, I've got a new mission. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, this... shoot. If you line up the quantum with me, I'm pretty sure I put a faster quantum drive in this. So you'll leech off that one, yeah. I don't have your beacon. Please. I am the radar. I don't have your beacon. No, that's um. <laughs> Unfortunate. No, I, I don't. What am I looking to quantum to? I've got no idea. I should have shared the mission with you. I You'd share you again. As I might have missed it. There we go. So I think you might just get dragged to see the way. Because I think that happened with us earlier. I can't read my quantum display because the sun's in the way, so I can't see if he's going to be dragged. And by, let me just prime the drive a second. Yeah, just calibrate and then I'll take a second. Wait. And by, what? Oh, we spoke off there. Yeah. Calibrating. Um, stand by. Stand by. And complete. Ready when you are. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my god! Look at it with the ship next to us. I can't see the ship next to us. Um, yeah, neither can I, unfortunately. Take a screenshot oh, if you can. can. Oh, you're slightly in front of us and to the right. Yeah. Hang on, just for everybody on Discord, I'm gonna take a photo. Yeah, because I can't see it, unfortunately. I'll drop it in um one of the things. Yeah, it works. What? What's it happening? Because it looks friggin' cool. It really does. Uh, oh, no. My camera is not moving with uh, my turret, so I can spin Your entire behind. setup just seems to be fucked today. You got a new mic and everything's broken. Literally. No, it's You're just broken. this game. Well, your mic isn't related to this game. Exactly why? But your mic was a bit weird. Yes, the Blue Yeti yeah, thinks he's the dog's bollocks. Yeah, yep. he came in with like a super heavy bass boost and he's like, Hello, I am Owen. Which is I. Wow, that's really cool. Yeah, I dropped one in Spark recording. Is I, Vectron. Yeah. Yeah, it's one. Mm. Oh, sorry, did you drop one? Nah, uh, it's still about the same. Did it, did it, did it, did it, did it. Did it, did it, did it, did it. I just put it in Spark That's what I said. It's awesome. Well, that looks fantastic, isn't it? doesn't it? That's beautiful. I've in chat, we'll post these on Twitter and Discord people. later. Oh, Chris just put one in general as well, but I'll have to put one on my socials later. So you can take a look at it, because that looks beautiful. See? Moments like that. That's what they, These are the bits that make the game worth it. There's but... a few videos online. I think people did a competition like, it's called Vista Stars and stuff like that, where it like shows off the abilities of the game. Like That type of content I love. Yeah. Hey, Jet, just turned into a mystery thing. Uh, we crashed ship, blew up ship, fell out of ship, died a couple times. Now we're back. That was the first hour. Oh, great. What? Well, you dead. just ejected me out. <laughs> what I'm just in the middle of space. Yeah. What nice. did you do, though? You have to have done something. Yeah. Nope. What did you press? I was just, um, uh, yeah, okay. The only thing I did is that I turned off the turret. Right, well, don't do that, then. Don't yeah, don't do that. If it's working, you just kind of sit there and enjoy the ride. It wasn't working. That's why. Yeah. Because, like, when I end up... Uh, You're in quantum. You're not able to shoot in quantum. Yeah, when I I'm... know, but the thing, what was happening is that my camera was fixed and the turret was spinning around me. So I was... You can spin me. <laughs> moving with the turret. That happens in quantum. It goes back to normal. It's a bug. Yeah, yeah the turrets always wiggle around in quantum. Into quantum. Yeah. No. Uh, yeah, when I enter first person, I'm apparently in the depths of space, but then when I go third, I'm apparently with you, so... 
Yeah, it just happens. It's, it's a desync thing. Mm -hmm. So just wait, be patient, eat something. Or the above. Casual Johnny Quango. Uh, Jack, you should play VR chat. Uh, I never really tried that, and I don't think I'll try it to be honest. A cup of I, I play a lot of VR games, usually like Beat Saber, Invaders Mortal, and um, uh, Blade and Sorcery, which is kind of fun. Also, Beat Saber did 4 million copies there, I believe. Beat Saber is great. Uh, very nice. That Bob's really good. If you, if you, yeah, we've got that one as well. I don't mind it too much. The control scheme's a bit, like, finicky. Yeah, once you get used to it, though, it's real fun. Yeah, I've watched recent that player quite a lot. Yeah. Cans? Uh, no. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. <laughs> Anyone got any funny stories they would like to share? Uh... <sighs> no. Cool. Cool. Yeah. That, that, that was a good conversation. I know. No, I, I'm a stellar conversationalist, me. I know. Very, very well, I'm at the elevator if it interests you. Jack, where is the hammerhead? Uh, it's in an asteroid system, about two parsecs from here, in a few pieces. So, that's where it is. You can go find it if you want. You see the yeah. sun? Yeah, that's not the sun. Yeah, we were doing very well, and then the pilot fucked up. Yeah, honestly, yeah. stupid Kraz. Yeah, Kraz, absolute douche. Well, we don't advance these things. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yep, we're just gonna roll that story. Yeah, that's what's yeah. happened. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hashtag Kraz did it. Mm -hmm. I love a Quantum Drive animation. This is one thing I've always found like fascinating about this game: just how beautiful it looks in Quantum. Yeah. yeah. I like how also they're not really afraid to actually make it realistic and make it like you wait a bit. Well, this has it. been a discussion that's going on for a while, like how long should you wait in quantum travel? Personally, um, yeah, I'd love to be able to instantly, but at the same time, when more features in the game, you are going to be able to do stuff during quantum travel, like update your inventory or, you know, repair your ship, etc. or do various things like that. So it makes sense why it's taking that time. It also adds like levels to the gameplay as well. It's almost like, you know, very, not lazy le level design, but convenient level design in a way, because you can have things take time when you travel around. And it does add to the units as well. You don't want everyone like blink driving to each system. That would also not be very good in terms of like chasing stuff around. Um, there's also um, like you can, no, I think someone just activated a turret on my ship. <laughs> Detonation <laughs> sequence in five. <laughs> Yeah, I can hear some noises on my ship in the background, but uh, with quantum drives, there's like different quantum drives you can get. You can get ones that are more fuel efficient, you can get ones that are faster. So there is an aspect to it, and like, there's no loading screens in the game, which quantum does give them a way to do that. And also, the space we're flying through right now, someone could interdict us and pull us out into real space where we are. Yeah, so there is that element to it as well. Thing. Chris, why are we stood still? No. You're not. You got in the turret, right? Yeah. Yeah. Just... Are we not moving? No, we are moving. Yeah, just just be. Um, if you're in the turret, it's a bit glitchy, so you just got to wait until we come out quantum, then you should just re sync up. Yeah, it's a sync issue, especially if you get in the turret while you're in quantum, it doesn't always work properly. It'll be mm -hmm. fine. See, does it when. If you go into quantum, but you have one chip that can't make its destination, but one chip that can, they go side by side, what will actually happen? That's a good point. I don't know. Why couldn't we we jumped out of quantum at a station? Magic. Okay. Well, it's a kind of magic. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, song. Just don't touch anything, Leo. The yeah. new DFS sailor. Again. Pray for the best. Is DFS even still going anymore? Did they shut down? Yeah, I've got one near me. Mm. I gotta go buy a sofa. Yeah, it's right next to Debenhams. I need to go see a man about a sofa. Yeah, well, I'm moving. So, oh, are you? Uh, nice. Oh, same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Should be fun. Move into a house rather than a flat. Living the dream. Yeah. <sighs> I just don't like stairs. <laughs> you lazy son of Actually, a... I walk up and down the stairs in this fucking flat building enough. Yeah, that's... Quite, it's quite a few flights of stairs, but that way. <laughs> <laughs> Worth it's like, yeah, I've got delivery downstairs. Can get, yeah, I'll be there. You run out, it lifts like, you know, on the... Fucking tenth bloody floor, and I'm like, oh, for God's sakes, <laughs> run all the way down. By the time I get down there, so I'm like, plonk a step out the fucking lift. I'm warning. I'm like, yeah, fuck you. I don't. I had, I had my new monitor delivered, so what, three hundred odd quid. Yeah. And, uh, you delivered it. I got a notification on my phone. Your parcel has been delivered. I'm sat in my living room, like, what? <laughs> I walk outside. It's raining. There's just a box on my doorstep, and I'm like, thanks. It, it, 
and it's not like it's not wrapped or anything. It's just a monitor box. I was right. like, I'd have been off with that if I was anyone other than me. Yeah, <laughs> uh, we have a problem with paths being stolen around here at the minute. It's like the security spot. So as soon as like I get a notification, I'm actually stalking the driver up the road. That's so why I'm waiting for my balcony to repair, just like start leaning over again and going, Oi! <laughs> Bring that to me! <laughs> they, they put the decking down now, but it's not actually put the rest of it down. Oh, I see. So the builders do this thing where we turn up for a week, do some work, and vanish for about a month? Yeah, that happens. I, I sometimes have respect for builders, forward. sometimes not. Bollocks me, I went to get my toes. It's sat on the floor downstairs. I'm surprised that's not been nicked. To be fair, At this rate, I'll do it myself. Do it, go on, do it. Hey Jack, what if you added a carrier class out of fleet? Um, yeah, I probably would do it at some point, but it's not really something I'm working on right now. In a sec, I hope Jack's doing great with his career. Yeah, we're doing fine, to be honest. Like I say, the quantum travel always takes time, so it's a great time to chat to you guys and just chat about random shit in general. If you see me leaning off the side by the way, it's because I was eating something and taking a drink, because I was not eating anything today. This music sounds very Halo Wars esque. What song was that? I, I honestly don't know. I've got other music playing in the background. Fair enough. Highway to the danger zone. Uh, no, I did have that actually, but no. We just have the interstellar, like, film soundtrack just playing. It's like, amazing. 24 7. Yeah. I, I even have that on. We're I, still in, um, we're still in winter right now, aren't we? Yep. Yes. Okay. Start choosing, just choosing an Instagram caption as one to be, like, factually correct. I mean, it's yeah, basically for next month. Hmm. Uh, I generally just go December, January, February, winter, and then, right, from there. And it roughly works out to how it is listed on a calendar. Mm -hmm. Has it been snowing recently where you guys are or not? We've just had rain. And more rain. And more rain. Same. Every, every time I go out, it rains. I'm like, I'm potentially, I was on a call, um, was it Monday? And I was talking to somebody like from um, Nova Scotia in Canada, and they've got like heavy snow there currently. And I said, I said, oh, typically British weather. I bet you, as soon as I go to the shop this afternoon, it'll rain. Like as soon as I set the first up the door and put the bin out, as soon as I like put my key in to get out the door, I pissed it down. And I'm like, no, sod it. I'm just gonna walk. So I came back rather wet. I was like, oh well, you know. Hmm. And at this point in time, I've like given up trying to like just dodge weather in this country. I've reached 22 years. And I can't give a shit anymore. Yeah, there's we're forecast snow here on like Sunday or something. But it keeps on appearing and disappearing off the forecast. Mm -hmm. We had a we had heavy snow on Sunday, I think it was. Um, yeah, it might have been Sunday, just gone. It was all right. It was in the morning. It was just heavy fl flows of snow, and that was it. Yeah, it, we had quite. I think like the whole nation really had that heavy snow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That was fun. I had, I had it on the day I was doing a course. I was like, great, this is going. Nice. <laughs> A few spaces, maps, a store if you want to use it for videos. Uh, we're kind of planning some stuff at the minute, but I'll let you know if you case. Hey Jack, I was wondering, are you going to add Ardibo Law to the new survival series of Wars? Nope, because it's not one that needs uh, story or lore to do it. It's, the new survival series is made to be basic in a way. Um, adding more stuff to it would require more work. Um, so it's meant to be basic. You can see little bits of what we're doing there, like with little story moments and stuff like that, with the NPCs, but it's not really something, um, it's not really something yeah, I want to do. Awesome. Are you calling us basic? No, I'm calling the story basic. And the whole idea behind the survival series was to be basic. <laughs> like a bunch of basic bitches. Yeah, doesn't leave any lore or anything, it's just a bit of fun. 700k up. 650. Copy. Oh boys, can't get wait to crash into an asteroid again. Hooey. Should we try I mean, to see if we can sever off every single... I can't wait to crash into each other this time. Yeah, that's gonna be the thing, isn't it? That's probably what's gonna happen. Mm. Yeah, I'm just gonna... So we'll shoot our missiles at each other. This is a different cloud. Ooh, yes. Ooh. Oh, this is oh, nice. yes. I see nav lights in there. Yeah, it looks like it, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, there's a station in there. Oh, that's the one I see on the menu. Well, all of them have stations in them, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and I've realigned to mining claim. Copy. Are you guys out here behind us at all? Yeah, I've got about 20 seconds of cooldown. My drive isn't responding again. Uh, on my screen, it shows you. Oh, if you calibrate. Okay, you should be able to chuck me into it, shouldn't you? Yeah, if you calibrate towards the destination. Uh, I'm I can see that on my screen. I should be able to track you. And what are you doing? Well, okay, well, uh, I guess I'll see you guys. Uh, can everyone make sure they're in their turrets, please? Oh, did you get out? No, it just it just went, okay, you're you're in the middle of space now, so that's fine. It sounds like you got out, that's why. 
Yeah, your turret retracted. But no. well, technically, yeah. he did get out. <laughs> oh, wait, right. right. Jack, you ready? Yep, so I was freaking myself. My screen said behind me, Chance. Yeah, go. Cool. Let's go. It's not going. Ah. <laughs> you went without us. Oh. Uh, <laughs> left me. Um, good luck. Oh, bloody game. Right did you get out and get back in again? Yeah, I'll do it again now. Kraz just said in chat, he's in arena commander, by the way. Yeah. Why? Bench. Contacts. Chris, we might want to hold out. Contacts are eight clicks out. I can't see them on my screen. Are you just on board, correct? Yeah, yeah. I'm still in turret. Oh, yeah. I've seen that. I'm going to overcharge the engines. Gotcha. Quantum drive will still not respond. Yeah. Tossman engine is not responding, Captain. Captain, I can't give her any more power! Let's have a look. Where's the quantum on this? What's it called? Uh... Chris, they're off. Why are they off? Wish I could play Star Citizen. I mean, it's. Yes, yeah, it's. it's, it's, it's I just backed up and they disappeared. Hmm, that's a good sign. Wow. It's not like Delta in this, is there? No, definitely not on Miss Prospectors. <laughs> They're mining ships. You never know. I'm just going to back this up. Oh, uh, freaking drive and respond. So annoying because we can't literally jump at the minute. Oh, and you want to get double dogs? I guess so. Here we are trying to do a combat mission, and they're busy slacking off. Sure. I mean, I mean, it's the hot dog stand, you know? I know, right? That's important. Yeah. That's really important stuff. Literally, the drive won't respond currently. Do you want me to come down and try? Yeah, you might as well. Yeah, because uh, we can't go anywhere right now, so... Chris contacts 10 clicks out. Don't yeah, know. I'm sucking for him. Just prospectors again. Right, so How okay. do you remove the helmet again? Uh, hold up. Hold down F and then right click and it opens your inner fault menu. Oh, yeah. You think about getting it off. Ooh. I've been a co pilot seat for a minute. We could try and reuse the map essentially to end it. Yeah, you might need to retarget in the map. <laughs> Got it. Got it. We're charging and calibrating you. Yeah. Alright, so set us. Um, yeah, jump us immediately, then we'll just reset. R2, I need you to reset the Navi computer! <laughs> <laughs> okay, jumping. Yeah, I know. I'm not too fast. Right, switch. Oh, uh, come on, can we get out of the jet? Stupid thing. Oh, no, there's the other it's one. It's because I got it first. There we go. Oh, this is... Oh, we're being shot at! In your seat! I'm I... out of the seat. I'm going. Go, go, I'm go! Red alert! Uh, there's also an asteroid in front of us. <laughs> oh, for God's sakes, man! If we blow up again... It's your fault. I'm not taking responsibility. Why? Uh, Jack, you might want to... Uh... Yes, I know! Okay. Ouch. Right, there you go. Now we're in action. Uh... Situation report, Chris? Uh, some, some miners are shooting at me. They seem to be a little bit annoyed. No targets in our scanners. Yeah, I got two of them by them, but uh, I think they're going to clear out before we get there. Oh god, the guns are On route! Slow. Yeah. There we go. It's gone. Alright, I've cleared out the enemies now to fly around and try and find these uh, thingies. Well, I we'll think follow your lead. We did all the work there, Jack. Exactly, yeah, you know, we came in the last minute, solved the problem. Totally cleared it up. Oh, thanks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm here for more support. Guys. Couldn't have done it without you guys. It's a thankless job, really, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, I see some lights flashing. That's probably a station, isn't it? I'm not sure. Uh, it should be... Oh no, we jump past that. Yeah, we should be a decent distance out. I see something on the ashram. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Should I shoot him? Jack, you're drifting. Yep, 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 yep. What about? Is, it appears they've changed it so like it drifts a lot more now. Yeah, they changed the flight dynamics again. Uh, uh oh, Jack. Yep. Contacts. I'm not that close. Oh, sorry. I was thinking we were. 
killing something. Uh, Leon, do you see where they are? They're not on my screen. Yeah, 15 clicks out, I think. Starboard and up. Oh, yeah. I've oh. just done I've just done over next. Behind us. Okay. Yeah, if you got them. Yep, uh, got it. Go on target. How many weapons, Mr. Reed? Okay. Come on. Focus. Yeah, we can't target it's an asteroid anyway. Yeah, so on route to aid support. Nice one. Oh. It's going past. It's a good time to note my weapons don't spawn. Um, not a good one. Better late than never. Well, if you press backspace, you should be able to. Don't do that. It. Don't do that. For the love of God, don't do that. Yeah, I, I've got no control of missiles or turrets. Alright, do we want to try, try swapping again and see what happens? Just give up at this point, just keep firing. I am, yeah. I can't. I think I'm your gun's just cool. overheated, actually. If you divert all power to uh, weapons, I think that might increase the call rate, but I don't know. Right, we need to find some... Freaking guns! <laughs> yeah, sure, I can't shoot anything. Nor can I use the missiles, apparently. Uh, the missiles um, have restrictions on them. You can't be flying faster than the white line on your HUD, like on the speed thing. Um, there's oh, like a bolded speed. line. You can't be flying faster than that, and they have uh, real restrictions on distances and angles to fire missiles. It definitely wasn't working out because I was in the acceptable boundaries anyway. I can't yeah. use my turret as well, so it must be bugged. This is my main guns won't fire. Which is yeah, a bit weird. Yeah, you can't use the um, panels either, can you? I guess panels, they're fine. Why can't you? That's part of the ship, uh... so... Hmm. How weird. You can change your panel to the guns, maybe switch them off and on again. I can try. Uh, weapons. <laughs> we got contacts, apparently. Contacts. Yep. Uh, directly above, Chris. And we divert some power, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, cool. Oh, I've messed up the power thing there. The turret relative mode. I've got no idea. <laughs> Where's targets? Uh, directly, hang on, above us, I think. Above? Yeah, towards Chris. My scans are delayed as well, so I can't tell where people are. Yeah, oh, taking fire. Still no weapons responding. I'll take you in and do the best I can. Yep. Boom. Missile standing by. Two more. Missile underway. I've got no firing arc. You top or bottom again? There we go. Top. There you go. Okay. Down. Nice. I don't know what. We've got an we've got an alarm on the ship. I don't know what the hell that alarm was for, but something's just. Mm. Yeah, I got that as well. I don't seem to be picking up any hostiles. Like an emergency yeah. alert alarm or something. I'm just gonna go search around see if we can find any of these uh, sentries. Oh, I was still here for a sec. We'll keep scanning. Let's see if we can do anything about your guns. Uh, I'll try and get it and get in again. Bloody ship! Bloody Torchwood. What? Hmm. Alright, let's try again. Let's do it again. <sighs> well... One of the ship has other weapon watches again. I believe you can mount some different weapons on it, but... Well, yeah, I don't think. Mm. Uh, 
of what ship? Funny. Oh, I'll put different weapons on mine. There you go. Yeah, I can't fire weapons at the table for some reason. Yeah, I've got Vader repeaters on mine rather than cannons. Oh god, I'm stuck in the turret again. Oh lord. As in, it kicked me out of the turret and then I got stuck in the floor. Welcome. Contacts, port, and. and I'm oh, no, I'm not. I'm in space. Here. Oh. Now I'm in space. You're dead. Yep. Uh, what's the button for med pens? Uh, should be holding H. Cool, because I've got 40 seconds to live. Have to come pick you up? I don't know that you'll get a chance to, because med pens are not working. And also, there's a bunch of enemies, right? Oh, uh, shit. Do you, huh? do you have any equipped? Yeah, yeah, two. Okay, uh, just start up spamming. It might be V or something, or C. Yeah, it might be V or C. It's C. It's C, you useless people. Well, I'm, I'm bound to hate. <laughs> I had two seconds left on my life. Oh god, I can see all the gunfire in the distance. It's all the way! Uh, I got missile! Oh goodness. Uh, ah! Oh, they do look good. Yep. That was a missile alarm I heard a minute ago. That's what it was. Something else locked onto us. So you still oh. guns, Jack. Ne negative, no guns. I think our shields are taking damage. Yeah, you're getting pummeled on. Commence <laughs> ramming speed? <laughs> Chris, we should probably rescue him. Yeah. We may have been to assist. How do you lock your camera on the missiles? Uh, well, hold down, middle mouse, like, continue holding it down. Ooh. Gotch. We're getting shot in the rear. There we Ah. <sighs> I'm this ship does not sound healthy. No. May I make a suggestion, Jack? Yes, go on. Abandon ship. I agree. P come park near us. We'll park at like 100 meters away from us. Yeah, I'm about 100 meters away. We're about sorry, like distance was. Okay. Uh, I'm 165 from your marker. I'm 1.2k away from you guys, so. Better get those med pens. Mm. Watch those wrist rockets. I'm just checking something right quick. You're self destructing, are you? I'm trying to. Yeah. <laughs> but I can't remember to keep mine to do it. Hold down. It should be back space, but I've had issues with self destruct. I've taken to ramming my ship into stuff to get it to blow up. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> what? No, I can't. Why? Even a self destruct doesn't work. Oh. What was that? Me. Come on, keep firing. I'm not gonna play it up with you in it. Do you wanna get out? We'll do some damage, Joe. I wanna see how much damage you can do. Take shields down. You've got shield holes as well in that ship, remember? Oh, yeah, we do, don't we? Yeah. Shield holes? Yeah. Yeah. Holes in the shield. Oh. Oh, so that. Uh, uh... That's what. We love Star Citizen. Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, oh abandoned ship. Hang on, I'm just gonna switch you off. Then I'm gonna come on board and blast the shit out of it. Where's the freaking off button? There it is. Uh, well, we do have a slight problem. Which is? Oh, the enemies. Alright, you you target them. I'll I'll do something. I'm just floating in space. Coming over towards Jack. It's probably not a good idea, is it? No, I gotta... Chris, just sit tight. What attack speed? Oh god, I was gonna try ramming that one. You blew it up. Oh lord. She, she's not having a fun time at the minute. <laughs> captain! Oh wait, I am the captain. You are there, Reed? Just, oh, just, just, just having a good time. I am Reed. Just gonna be there for all eternity. Yeah, might go hang out by this asteroid. Mm. Just like Bender while he's flying through space. Pretty much, yeah. Can start a small civilization. Yeah, so. Yep. I'm just going to check uh, how to self destruct you. Um, what would you class self destruct as? Boom. Like a big boom. 
piss off. Like, under flight, what does it come under? Um, uh, I don't know. It should be... Uh, it's it's back. It's back. Like, it, back. It's definitely backspace. I've shot, yeah, oh, it's numpad back. plus, that's why it is. Oh, they changed I'm, it. I've, I've rebounded it previously or something like that. No, it's still I think they changed it. No, no, because I'm looking at it right now. It's backspace. It's Chris, amazing. whereabouts are you? I'm coming close. All right, know. stand by. Would be safer if we picked him up and then just blasted it to pieces? Because we don't know when that's going to go off. Now the shock yeah. sequence initiated. Abandoning ship. You have about 10 seconds. What? <laughs> Genuinely, that's what you have. Go, 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 not be that close, Chris. It's fine. We're 300 meters. I'm just going to lock myself at the side. <laughs> Open the freaking door. Go! <laughs> I'll fly to you, I'll fly to you in a sec. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus oh, Christ, that was oh. close! <laughs> Fucking hell! Oh. Hello? Uh, um, I was trying to avoid the spinny bits. First, I'm on route to you. Okay, I'm coming in close. I do have radar. Nobody knows. I'll come to the side, uh, side, side yeah. airlock. lock. I'll come to your right hand side. This whole position. Hey, I'm, gonna have to this. I'm firing. Oh my! <laughs> it gave me a new pistol. It's an executive assault one. Sorry, I'll stop chatting and get on board. <laughs> Stand by. Almost on. Approaching door. Oh god, that just flew overhead. Opening door. It just smacked me in the face almost. Oh god. Oh fuck it. I'm on board! Go, go, go! Help. Oh my god, this is... This is Star Citizen. Are <laughs> oh, you gonna get on the bottom turret, Jack? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh no, I'm in the captain's seat, or in a seat right now. I'll get in it in a minute. At least Chris has his guns. There's that, yes. <laughs> there is that! Ugh. <sighs> Oxygen, do I have? Oh, you mean you pick up meat? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I have plenty, apparently. Why did you do that? The ship was basically effed. Like, my ship wouldn't fire and it wouldn't just properly work, so we blew it up. At least we never self struck sequence works. So, Jack's blown up two ships, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are we going to add that to the counter or? <laughs> Asteroid are glitching the hell out. And it has gravity. What the hell? Alright, we're coming to pick you up. Yeah. That'd be lovely, thanks. <laughs> Mark the farm. Chris, do you know where he is? Yeah, I've got a marker. I don't, so. <laughs> yeah, just don't shoot him. Please, no shoot. How many war crimes are in Star Wars? Can someone help? Probably a lot. And they committed one. Then it's against droids, though, so I don't know. Yeah, it was. Is it a war crime if it's against droids? I don't know. Battlestar Galactica would seem to disagree. Droids are people, legit or quick. Yeah, I've been rewatching Stargate Atlantis recently, um, and some of the stuff they did in that series is very questionable. Like when they tried turning a wraith into a human, and that genetic warfare oh. they tried. I'm like, I was watching like years ago, like it was a good episode. Now I'm morally questioning that. Yeah, that's, that's, that's eugenic. quick stuff. Yeah, I've got him. Alright. Why are there guns? Because there's radar contacts. Those guns sound a bit like the Expanse now. Right. Do, yeah, do you see where cool. I am? Yeah. Right, hop him on the side airlocks as quick as you can. I'm coming. Hello. Oh god. Oh my god. Jack's not already in it, you can get in the bottom turret. In the bottom turret, I'm watching in the cinematic view. Oh my god, what happened there? Your, uh, the docking collar just yeeted me. We've got multiple prospectors around us. Okay, I'm in. I face planted, but I'm in. Punch it, Chewy! <sighs> LT, get us the hell out of here! <laughs> oh god, do you know what's terrifying is listening to things hit the hole from indoors? It feels like the ship's shaking apart. That was a beautiful there. Yeah, it does. Chris, close all exteriors if you can. Doors still open. Good shot. Alright, you know what? Alright, getting in the lower turret.
Okay, here we go. Where's me? Switch those gyros I want. Isn't it with headlights? It's not seem to be working very well. Like the lights just are missing from the center of the ship. It's a bug of a Connie. Mm. Yeah, it does when you're in the clouds, I think. I like if the lighting engine still left. Probably. I have no hostile targets. What the hell? Well, we can They're all dead now. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I couldn't target them anyway. Yeah. That's good. Everything's left. Chris, do you want to get us back to base when this mission's complete? Well, the thing is, I. It doesn't look like the sentries are spawning. I think the mission's bugged. Should we vacate yeah. and get back to base then? Yeah, I was trying to look it up on issue council, but it's a bit hard when you're the pilot. Yeah, take us back to base then. <sighs> Might still want to close all exteriors. Both airlocks are open. <laughs> she does look beautiful flying through the um, clouds though. It does. <sighs> oh no. Got more contacts? No. Yep. Do we? Porting down. We might be able to jump out in time though. Yeah, we do. Uh, we can either leave them, or we can kill them and then leave. Um, let's kill them and then leave. Okay. Bring us about. How it will. Still got no targets. Shoot in that direction. I am. I can't see anything on screen either. Looks out of range. I do, yeah, I do see contacts approaching. Very small. Looks like three or four. Oh, I see them approaching, but like not five. On. Yep, five contacts. We got. Where's the other fire coming from? We got allies. Oh, Another ship's in system. Them. Yeah, we have allies. There are two of them. Uh, they. We got two wingmen. Actually. It was crazy, and missile just went right by us. Yeah, that's what I mean. I was like, what the fuck? Hey, they don't watch the flying, I'm gonna shoot them. <laughs> Fancy fly boys! <laughs> what are they flying? I can't see the target on. Looks like one of the uh, heavy fighters. Right. It's all fun and games where bring a javelin in. You should get that. I'd wipe the floor. Yeah, free grand, Leon. Yeah, yeah, Do some more work on Star Wars now, then, sure. Oops, oh, okay. Sure, give me more stuff. Today we're bringing you a Star Wars Explained video because Jack wants a javelin in whatever it's called. Star Citizen. Oh, what? Okay, I've officially... Oh, Leon's got to make it his personal goal to get you how many referrals it takes to get a javelin. Yeah, I think it's, um, what, 1,012 or something like that? 3,012? Yeah. I'm at, like, 200 referrals, something like that, so you've got quite a while to go. Yeah. So good luck with that. I believe. I believe. I believe I can fly. Right, are we clear? Oh, don't shoot the friendlies. What are you doing? Not a lie. So, the people who've joined us are called the Advocacy. There's two Anvil Valkyries out there and two Mantises. Mantises are the red glowy things. Yeah, so I think they're blocking quantum. Yeah, gotcha. Yep, they're interdictors. They should go away now, we've destroyed targets. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. And if they don't, we can kill them. <laughs> yeah, we'll kill them as well. Kill them now. Oh, yeah, it's the Valkyries. I love the Valkyrie. Yeah, they've Engage. Oh. I'm gonna fly out of her. Right. Skip the word. I have one locked. What's the name of your org? The name of your org is Red Red Industries, and um, we're already underway. Yeah, there wasn't that much of a range on them. Good, that's quite cool. Where are you taking us to? All the way back to Tressler? I'm going back to Hurston. Right, cool. Or can you commence planetary landing when you land at the space station? I'll land at the space station. Okay, good. Then we can uh, call it data. Yeah. Well, guys, how are we doing? Operation Cinder Space is built, built more. I mean, yeah, it literally was Cinder. I don't even think I, that's way above a war crime at that point. That's just genocide. I was watching Deep Space Nine. Mm -hmm. You know the episode where Cisco just, you know, poisons the planet's atmosphere to humans? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was curious about that. And it's technically legal under Federation war, uh, law, even though it seems like a war crime. Yeah, Federation's very, although it's like a utopian society, they do like bending their rules. So it's why I had like Section 31 was technically legal. Because it was a charter in, like, if you think, it's, Section 31 was well, the charter. Yeah, the way I 
I found it explained was that basically the Federation encounters threats sometimes that they need to destroy a planet for, so that's why it's legal, but um, it does seem a bit dubious, poisoning a planet's atmosphere to the current inhabitants of said planet. Yeah, that, that definitely um, breaking a lot of the conventions there. How they weren't, like, how Cisco wasn't brought forward to the board and, like, completely, completely <laughs> riddled, I have no idea. <laughs> That's uh, the joy of um, Deep Space Nine for you, really. <laughs> playing with mouse and keyboard or joystick? I'm playing with mouse and keyboard currently. I typically do play with a joystick sometimes. I've got it not plugged in today as I just set up my desk again. Um, but yeah, and also hotel's controls are a little bit finicky at the minute. Also, your yeah. jump drive is like massively fast. Okay. Um... Oh! <laughs> yeah, we went too far away. But it is, um, it's got like a 30 second cooldown on it. Oh, okay. So it's a bit of an off trade then. For the speed is worth it. Oh, true, yeah, definitely. Oh, okay, interesting. Imagine the Expanse game but built in fast systems engine. Uh, I'd love that, that'd be great. Uh, that You'd have to dial it back quite a bit and make some significant changes. But imagine like arriving at a planet like this is Illus in a way. Mm, it'd be really interesting. Or if I say the well. other one, which Chris will know what I mean, that'll be really interesting. Yes. <clears throat> okay. Even Mars in general, with a belt, imagine like that doing like Seri Station and such. Mm, I believe mm. yeah, the belt would probably be a good groundwork to work from. It's approaching to ring as well. Mm. Oh, yeah, Rossi. oh yeah, so you get your own like class of starship in a way. I'd definitely have a Donager. Mm, but it has to be like definitely a star system next game. It mustn't be like an MMO or whatever. It would have to be set in the Expanse like... Um, you can even do like Squadron 42, like layer that with the Expanse. That could probably work a bit more because it's contained then. Yeah. Mm. Building a whole universe would be a little bit risky. I'm surprised they've not made an Expanse game yet. I'm gonna have to jump around uh, okay, cool. the orbital markers to get around to the station. Are you guys already at Hurst? Yeah, we're just getting to the that we're above yeah. Oh, are you, are you guys going down to the planet or are you going to Spaceport? Oh, planet. Uh, not planet, sorry, station. That's cool. Okay. Uh, I'm heading over there as well. It's called Terra Invicta. Oh, yeah. It's, a, it's an RTS, but it has the same like expanse style combat system. And it's centered around there's Earth and Mars and the belt. Okay, that'd be interesting. Because Expanse is a board game itself, isn't that something? It started out as like a role playing game. Yeah, because that's how the idea came about. Yeah. It's, um, so the reason why Shed was killed was because the guy who like played Shed in their game left their game at that point. That's why <laughs> Shed was killed. What I love that I only clocked this recently, so I'm quite a fan of Designated Survivor on Netflix. And the guy um, who plays Shed was in Designated Survivor, so I think he left the Expanse to go into that as well at some point. Like, that's probably a convenient way he took on the series, but also could leave, because he appears in Designated Survivor as like the White House um, like PR manager or something like that. That was a good show. He's not brought back in Season 3 because Netflix made budget cuts and cancelled the show, because, you know, why not? Yeah. Netflix does this thing where it tries to increase the budget each season, and then if it doesn't make it by like two or three seasons, they just cut it. Yeah, I mean, that is Business 101 really, but... I was very close to that planet atmosphere there, yeah, very close. I think I could have reached out and like picked up a drink. Yeah, it wasn't playable with... Did you do it manually? Uh, that one, no, but the rest of them I had to do manually to the <laughs> orbital markers until it let me lock Everest Harbour. Magnetize, magnetize! Oh god. Jesus baseboard. The guy who asked if it's possible to jump through a planet, it is not, because we accidentally tried it once and we all died. Yes. Yeah, you'll just you jump into the planet where you die. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a bug, and it's a trader's worst nightmare. I think that was our second recording session, trying to get the uh, Prison Break episode. Because we had three of those, right? The third one was where it actually worked. First one, none of us could get into the game, because there had just been a patch and everyone was oh, in. Oh yeah, the servers were down. <laughs> and the second one, we all died after jumping into the planet. Great success. Ah, chat, how are you doing? Jack, is it possible to Oh, yeah, Leon just answered it. Yes, but instead of getting sick, you just leave uh, well, Okay, chat, Adam, fuck you on about Um, What was it? What the fuck? Ah, what the Okay, right, they're, they're on something in the chat, not a clue. <laughs> I believe he's like killing all the citizens. I'm like, okay, that's enough of that. Yikes. It's why we don't let us jump in gravity in space. Uh, yeah, it's also a game engine limitation, really. You could also pull off some really weird game breaking stuff if you could do that NSC, so it's, not, it's a good thing it's not there. <laughs> It stops you jumping ships that aren't Atmo capable into Atmo accidentally. Yeah, that's going to save you from that. Although it'd be hilarious to see. I wonder if there's a mod that removes those limitations. Or is, is it hard-coded? 
Uh, sometimes the game removes those limitations. Itself. Yes, it does. That's why people crash into the moon. <laughs> I think it's when a planet loads, it brings it with it. Like, it tells you that you cannot jump here. Because that's why mm -hmm. people randomly transport into the moon, like, eons ago in one of the surface. This is, um, which station is this called again? This is Everest Harbour above Lawville. No, a nice station, isn't it? I swear they've extended this. Was this out here like that last time? Like the docking clamp thing in the head? No. Uh, I don't know. That's the car new cargo processing bit, isn't it? Uh, that'll either be a cargo or refinery deck. Yeah. It looks refinery. The refinery decks are cool because they've... They're all like the same at the moment, but they've got a store in. Yeah. That's like before mining. You can buy all your mining gear there. You can oh, rent nice. all your like ships and stuff there. So you can rent um, a prospector a cutlass black and the rock which is the like mining ve like ground vehicle yeah it is isn't it yeah so it's like it's all in one place and it's a good place to go to buy multi-tools as well because you know that they're gonna have them yeah, yeah you're playing like, the game it feels like you're not i'm basically co-pilot currently so that's why um that's why i'm around here i was gonna say i'm a turret but we just better suit to that so <gasps> okay and i'm at Everest harbor nice right, so we're commencing docking or about to anyway Yep, I'm about to... I'll actually request docking with my fighter. Jack, have you seen the new Milky Star one as it looks similar shapes to Millennium Falcon? Uh, I wouldn't agree with that one, but yeah, I've, I've seen it. It looks kind of interesting. Don't have one myself, but um, it does look cool. I'm not a fan of all the like, small-esque ships, in a way. I crashed one of them. Yeah, you did, didn't you? Uh, yeah. Oh, that was before I updated it. <laughs> yeah, it ran out of fuel. Yeah. <laughs> oh, great. Right <laughs> it wasn't long after we actually tried that recording that they updated it. <laughs> Go figure. Right, we are landed. Fantastic, let's depart. My mother. Tell me a look at you guys. <laughs> Wish I just saw someone fall through the turret. Bye. Bye. Or not. Oh, there you go, really. Oh, no. Okay. Elevator, come on. Oh. Oh. If you look. Hello? If you look. Oh, for God's sakes. Cursing. No, don't press it again! There's a... Oh, hello, you Tom. Do. Yes, hello, do you see me? Okay. Take my head's off. Yeah. If you're like, you know, a couple of feet taller, you're gonna... have yeah. your head chopped off, aren't you? Right, let's get... It's actually legal to be over six feet, so... Temptation to get into Chris's seat in, in the ship itself strike sequence is very high there. <laughs> oh, I'm still in my seat. Oh, yeah, I was tempted to, like, wait till you get out and just hop in and go, Well, <laughs> there we go. Is this game coming to Xbox? Never. You're never gonna see this game on console, not for a million years. Um, if they somehow made consoles fantastic, you'd get on there, but this is purely being developed for PC, and that's already a pain in the ass as it is, so don't even expect it on uh, console, because that'd be a nightmare. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Red okay. elevator. I'm currently docking, so I should be in the lobby in a minute. Do, 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 do. The more you push the button. The other dude told me to get an adventure, so I just didn't care. No, I went and sat in the captain's seat, or you know, the co pilot seat instead, because I wanted to capture some cinematic views. Because then I can use it for some screensavers in future. Or at least, like, starting soon things. Have you seen the new... Oh, I read that tonight. Um... Yeah, and I wasn't flying my ship. I was watching it in third... Or third person mode, yeah. That's not flying. Da -da 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 -da. Here we go. Departing to lobby. Do 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 do. Oh. That'd be default elevator music. Behind. Do we? Yeah. Sorry! I'm waiting for the ship services to apply to the ship, so, <laughs> so it's all repaired and rearmed and refueled. It's a fucking long ass elevator. <laughs> yeah, the, quite a distance. Mm. Yeah, look at the look at the distance between your ship. Good point, actually. Yeah, look, look back at my signal. Look right here. About 5k away from me. There we go. Do you guys know the button to deploy the laser? Deploy the laser? On, on a ship. For mining, I think. Oh, god, no. Um, you oh. press M to switch into mining mode. Oh. It's really cool with stations give like such an immersive view as well. Like, you can just look out to the planet there, the other like, landing pads, so it's really nice. Hmm. Oh, this is definitely one of the best uh, stations for views because you can see Lawville from it and it has the massive building. There. Oh, yeah, you can literally see it there, can't you? Sticks up through the atmosphere, basically. Oh dear. That is super impressive. I need to go buy some weapons. Ugh. 
All right, everyone, we're going to be ending off the stream here as we've uh, found our endpoint. Um, so this is just a little bit, yeah. Uh, hopefully, the next patch is coming at some point, which will introduce the Xeno threat um, to the main game. So that's not PTU, so it's the actual live version. And that'll be something we'll try and get the community involved in as well. Having a bunch of, like, um, fighters and, like, big ships flying around taking on this event, it'll be fantastic. So that's something uh, we'll be looking to do sometime soon. Um, not sure when. Could you have any idea when it's coming out yet or not? It's in PTU now, isn't it? we don't know it's it just could so. be next week or it could be next month it's, it's on the map essentially so and a lot of like good reports coming out of it and a lot of footage on youtube right now so we'll be trying it out soon hopefully getting some of you involved if you are just enjoying this game join the discord discord.gg slash captain jack head over to star citizen channel share your ships with us tell us about the game ask any questions we should help and we'll be back in it very soon gents do you have anything else to say uh no, no it was fun. well it's been a pleasure uh, joining you as per usual as that was quite fun yeah it was yeah Indeed. Well, everyone, thank you very much for watching. I'm going to end off here as it's been fun as per usual. Streaming Star Citizen, and we're back next week either with more SC if the new patch does come out. If not, we'll be on Starbase, and then a week after that, we'll do Star Citizen. So keep an eye out for that. But I've been Captain Jack. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you very soon. Goodbye. Bye. See you. Bye.